like That's we should stream just... mm. oh you're gonna start the stream pre-game pre stream pre-game let's stream. go it's just me like the end of the password in the lobby oh you know what i learned yesterday hmm? you know the one slave province right oh no what did you it's say? only white people <laughs> so I... <laughs> no more black people slaves. I I mean, I guess you're not wrong. Wait, but there's also no wait, more black me. people for stop because we have just yeah we Africa. we gotta talk there's about also this. No more, Why did you delete all the black people? Why are you so? We racist? also deleted all of Asia. So. <laughs> no, no, you deleted all, all the black people. Why I'm are you sure so they still have race in between, like you know, like ah, oh, you're Slavic, ah, oh, you're Spanish, <laughs> ah, you're Latin, you're Turkish. Ah, you're right. Oh, your stream, your stream. There's gonna be a little amount of Sunni there. Make you for not racist. Uh, Islam is barely exist. No, not is racist. Islam barely exists. Well, there's a bit in Granada, and there's some was not in there's the autos, and that's about it. Well, I think someone better play uh, Granada and bring back, bring, bring, bring back Islam. Dead. You know, Carmen gave, or Poland gave Carmen a deal. It was like, yeah, if you become Orthodox, I'll give you Constantinople. <laughs> I want to do like, I want to do the funny and become is, is Sunni because there's so little Sunni. That's I mean, true. I guess you can. You made me why? Sunni. Why would you because made because me? I need to increase the, the population before it dies out. There's too little. But um, we should kill look, it. Look, people, people do one face all the time. People do one culture, so crying out loud. I mean, oh god, not the one. Culture. Yeah, Slavian culture uh, everywhere. Let them kill do. It. Look, people, people do one face all the time. Yo, you should have given me a. How many have? I need to learn the right mm -hmm. uh, so I know people are only, only so far, but I know people are currently talking to me while they're doing about it. Okay. Because the issue is, people don't do one tag well, on one sitting um, normally. Yeah, I'm also, no, I'm also, I'm also <laughs> gonna be eating noodles and playing EU4. I know there's a Yo. there's a I think the first is gonna be an Ottoman run. Um, yeah. but the Empire's feeding. Well, well, well. If if a uh, coalition or whatever forms on Ottomans, I need to take a suit. Well, no, I don't. Maybe take a Sunni province. I, I don't know who I'm gonna be playing as. I'll just. Well, yeah, honestly, I'll Aaron, decide. I know a run that's anyway. not finished yet. That's already further or, in date than you are. So. <laughs> Uh, are we doing as like as the as wait? As is as this? As are we doing like a new game or an? No, 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 no. There's a there's a E four event for a fancy role, and that is uh, deal one tag in the Europe only mode, and first first date completion wins. Okay. You no, know, you should make this. Oh, my hey, are one done. city only. You conquer the world, but you're only allowed to stay Subjects. in one province. You no, have to conquer just... the whole world, all of Europe, but you can only stay as like a city state. Think about that. Think about that. It has to be on the slave routes. <laughs> no, with the, what is your obsession with this? I'm gonna. I'm just gonna like. If I do this again, I'm gonna mod the game. I'm gonna remove the slave trade and replace it with like I don't know the, the friendship. Oh, you trade. can't remove history. I will. I will it's change history. it to the. I will change that. The the assault. Uh, Famous you need to have someone uh, abolish slavery so they can get the the clout for it. Oh, that's true. You can actually, whoever owns Azov can abolish slavery in the 1700s. Can they, though? Yeah, because you have yeah. a slave province to abolish slavery. <clears throat> oh. I know, what a weird requirement. Alright, I'm gonna make sure I get the province just so no one can do that. Just enslave the Europeans. Why would you want- Oh my god, you should unironically always abolish slavery because you can get a better trade, but like fucking wheat is better than slaves. Oh, no. And Portugal yeah, has a bunch of triangles, so like slaves are terrible. <laughs> slaves are amazing. No, no they're not, they're really not. They, 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 they give goods produced in every province. They don't. No. Why yes, could they do. I never join by they slave? Don't. Is it because I'm in You get tariffs Maybe. if you get the trading bonus. Did I just yeah, post the. I didn't. You I didn't. only put the password. <laughs> Bruh. Oops, it is. Hello. Who needs an ID? You don't need the ID. Look, this is, this is all liberal propaganda. You just joined by being friends with me on Steam. Oh, I can. Yeah, I think it's because I was. Um... Yo. There you go. Thank Do you want me you. to play Lemon? Alright, so the PW is, is the password. The P 
PW thing is the password, right? Yes. Okay. No, that's just that's just some friendship numbers I've got there. Some random. <laughs> some French uh, numbers. Oh, okay. <laughs> Are, aren't all the numbers French? Well, no, no, they are Arabic shit, numerals. They're, they're different types of numerals. Oh, God, that's a good point. We have to use Roman numerals because the, the, uh, like we haven't yeah. invented Egyptian numerals. <laughs> oh, that's true. Wait, they're not common. Like Latvian numerals. Maybe Cyprus? Don't worry, guys. I have XX infantry coming down. Infant infantry, please. Oh, it's oh my God, did I have a full better. back row? You need to build two II more cannons. You need to build II more cannons. <laughs> Bro, you have vi too many too much infantry in the uh, in the front row. You're overstacking. Hashtag Bavarian life matters. Six? That's not that many. <laughs> yeah, no, <I> <laughs> That's not bad. <laughs> You're gonna hear me say Bavarian lives matter for a long time. They don't. You know. Yeah, they really don't. You're gonna you're just gonna be like. Ha <sighs> A very large Why can't man. I just have like a normal youth where do. everyone respects every religion, everyone is like a nice normal person? Bro. Well, no, no, we we can't have that because be, yeah, we, be, because the, the Crusades, we we the Crusades. Well, Crusades, where are you Crusade? I specifically removed Jerusalem. <laughs> you can't Crusade. No more Crusades. Uh, you could not. Uh, uh, well, so well, well, you, you go. Well, you, we you Crusade on on the Protestants because they're heretics. What Protestants? It's fourteen seventy six. Epsilon. Uh, the Hussites. Well, when the Protestants Prague. come around, they do that. Uh, that's it's, the it's thing. In Prague. All right, guys. Um. Yeah, what? My, my, I, let's you say, let's do this. So my, yeah. my king is 30. I have no money, my air, so, uh, no. My air sucks. <laughs> I could so, even send gifts if I, if I wanted to. Fuck. So I'm going to be in a server. Have fun. Take it, take it. Right, well, there we go. Just before I get cancelled on Twitter 15 times over, I didn't endorse none of those messages. Thank you. But there we go. Well, death comes for us all. Uh, hopefully, England, England should be coming back. Most people should be coming back from what I have heard. I know quite a few people are around to sub, so there we go. But there we go. Right. Mm. Let's hope people figure out how to run the mod as well, which is going to be a fun activity for everyone involved. Mm. It is what it is. Right. Surprised how little Anthony's on Sweden, but I guess he is biding his time. But oh well. Honestly, expected more out of him. I guess that initial Denmark war was not that nice to him. Hmm. Right, there's the Teutons who will be to Prussia, I'm assuming. No questions asked then. Serious why they wouldn't. All right. Hmm. Uh -huh. Thank you, Lutheris. Lee Bacon. Yeah. I'm Georgia. Are you? No, you're not. Oh, yeah. You're Georgia? Yeah. Um, he's, he's, isn't there a Georgia player? Long Georgia. Well, there might be, but if it doesn't show up, then, then we Gucci. I'm Georgia. So, uh, what's everyone's, Georgia's like, Army. ideas? Okay. Like, uh, is, like, having three ideas now, like, good, or is it just middle? Mm, no. I have no. There's a there's a very very small bit of Tangri. I think I Reason, think the Kazan, I think Taigeta or the Kazan probably yeah, should go but Tangri. France has, France has like two, three, four. I think it's more than two. I, I think that I think the Kazan player yeah. should go Tangri because that, that that's, 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 that's almost gone. You literally can't because you need to be taken no. first before you can feel yeah. Tangri. That's here. Oh, that's not good. Yeah, I so feel like I wasn't compensated enough. But I could go Coptic. And then Bro. we just won. 
Yeah, Can well, go Coptic, I feel like we're really should, because but, you know in but Coptic we... where you take all the holy sites, like Alex said three. Yeah, the, the, the there's no holy sites. We're, we're we're screwed. Bro, I'm literally behind Burgundy in ideas. They've been death warring. In theory, we couldn't do Crusade on Karen, man, yeah, because they're. Yeah, but complain if I gave you too much stuff, so shut up. Or maybe you even like Crusade five. on Kazam because they're no, they're, no, they're, they're soon. I have three. We're doing two a little trolling. He's got three. I think it's fine. It's better than oh, three is. I've yeah. also given yeah. you money. Yeah. Yeah. You'd be oh, fine. Did you? Oh, the Discord is free. AI is like four corruption. You had. Oh, nice. What What about autonomy? Autonomy, I didn't touch that. You'll be fine. Just like increase autonomy if you want rest, right? Increase the time. Fine, I'll give you 100 autonomy everywhere by the next round. Oh, thanks, thanks, thanks. Uh, is Dino Serbius coming? Because I feel like. No, he just said. Also, it's very funny on how Austria got Berlin. Now, the, now the true Germany is going to be Austria. Yeah, you didn't know that. Oh, well, no. Normally, I thought that Brandenburg or Prussia would be the true Germany, but turns you know, out it's Hungary, Austria. Hungary's dying to Austria right now. So, it's great. Uh, uh, is just sitting there becoming but technically, the, the Protestant thing. Reformation has already begun since there is Hussite. We, we could no, do a crusade. It's already begun because in the next stage, it's soft. Crusade! Well, yeah, but, well, uh, well the, the Austrian player, or like the Bohemia itself, is already doing work on that, so we only have Prague left. Except Olamak is the yeah. Are you prepared to die? Yes. Kazan's gonna <laughs> die. Joel. No. Oh, yeah, where's the Slovenia, uh, Poland? Where's our England? Where's our Spain? Just My mortal enemy. To play one of them. Wait, Lithuania is Orthodox? That, that, that's very to. funny. Orthodox. I mean, really, it could be at this point. I mean, their entire expansion is kind of... Usually Poland's there. Uh, uh, also, the Teutonic Order decided to unite all their orders. Yep. Except for Riga, part. because that's not an order. That's that's I totally that part of the Livonian order, what? but it's not. Is that a is that a coalition war you're in? They have Livonian. They have Riga as a subject. Ah, okay. But okay. But uh, but but Austria played it. Do you still want that alliance, or are you too full on alliances? Uh, I honestly have no idea. Huh? Austria needs like four people to kill Brandon. In fact. I don't talk about that. He. But I'll keep on Orthodox because that's the that's the best religion. I, yeah. Find them, keep on starting, keep on this for a while. Third Rome is. Remember when Third Rome was. Also, I had no years. idea that it, Istanbul, or Constantinople, and Polish was Karagorod. Karagorod. Yep. At least I'm up to date on tech. Serbia actually has. That, I, I can't so see the know. tech map, so I don't know if if if, if six, I'm good six, on six, tech. Yeah, I had to give you like three techs as well. Did you? Easy tech. Bro, Bavarian AI is smart. With their 2 2 2 leader. Also, how did. Also, how did Catalonia and Aragon. How, how, did, how did the Catalonia thing happen? What, uh, what Aragonese happened? Aragonese Death War. The Aragonese the Death War in Castile, yeah, because Aragon was a player, and Portugal is still kind of is a player. So, 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 like, the Castile player just released Catalonia and gave Catalonia mainland Aragon? No, he, uh, that, that's a subject. He took that land, released Catalonia, and fed Catalonia Aragon. He made it to a okay. subject in order to not have to deal with rebels during his bankruptcies. Basically. Yeah, okay. Basically. Because Death War and Death War is not a fun activity for any country that wants to survive. Look at England right now, and they lost their heavies. Yeah, that that pretender must be really good if they're indeed killing themselves. Well, they're bankrupt, so. Oh, that's not good. Right. Um. Now, what are we doing? We, where's we Poland? The war. Where's England? Where's Spain? Where's Canada? They're dead. I mean, we could say where's Georgia, but I don't really. I I want to stay as Georgia. Like this, this is fun. Uh. Well. You don't get to decide that. But okay. stuff. It depends I'll on see. if he shows up. <laughs> yeah, if he shows up on Fed, I suppose. But what are you drinking? Who who's drinking what uh, straw? And also how how ha what is going on with, with Irish England? Did That's England go oh, Irish? Oh, yeah, to form Ireland it's a strong attack. Okay. Yeah. In terms of but... ideas, not attack, sorry, but you know what I mean. Uh right. Hey, you know, is England Sabuin? is not doing good. He's here. Okay. Yeah. 
Somehow Byzantium is still alive. Ah, uh, yeah, they've been kind of fed around the place. Um, yeah, I think Constantinople should be reunited with Byzantium. Just an unpopular opinion. Oh, there you go. Right. Okay. Right. Wait, wait. Did 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 the Austrian player just leave the VC? He probably went to the Okay, but well, why are we leaving to other channels? Is that I like to discuss with allies? Uh, right. Well, I've been thinking randomly. Where is this person? Also, why is Cyprus involved in this mod if they're technically in Asia? No, no answer, okay. Well, look, it's complicated. And no, they're not actually in Asia. They're yeah, okay, I understand. It's complicated. It is indeed very complicated. But it's how useful with the game is to find this, yeah. The, right. the easiest try would just be play a Cypress and do nothing and just like self isolate no, because you're, you're person, already doing terrible. Or maybe like the caravan player was planning on attacking Cyprus, but they never did. Or maybe they're just bad at Navy, like me. Again, the thing is with Navy is that no one takes Navy ideas or anything, so if you just build enough boats, you'll be fine. Which kind of screws right. the whole situation, but there oh, we go. Do you want me to play somewhere else, or shall I stick on the I'm start I'm going to look around and see if you actually, because I, I very much prefer it when people actually tell me that I'm going to shop instead of just uh, not showing up, which isn't fun. Yeah. Uh, so person is very on about how I don't worry, I'm going to be subbing Castile, and they're not here, so yay. Um, yeah. That's fun, good to know. Also, who, who's going to be flipping right. the Protestant when the Reformation begins? Honestly, probably everyone. You should... Well, I'm not, I'm, well, I'm already Orthodox, so I'm probably not going to flip since Orthodox is the best yeah, religion. But most Catholics definitely will. I mean, France, example. Yeah. Yeah, Poland should. said okay. that... Uh... He only needs someone for 30 minutes, so Poland will probably be here. Okay, Poland will hold you in 30 minutes, that's fine. Then, sure, what can I stop? Is the Lithuanian player in VC? Probably another one. Right, one moment. No, he's here. Uh, Lithuanian player, Joe's, Joe's, wait, yeah, Joe's, Joe's, do, do, do you want an alliance for both Orthodox? I'm, I'm the Georgian player. Never mind. Apparently, the Spain sub's uh, dad has uh, fell over and uh, he has to take him to the hospital. So that's. Uh... That's awkwardly detailed. Yeah, so. I, I can't tell if the Lithuanian player wants right. an alliance or not. In that, that case, uh, right, Lord. He can't. He already has to. Is Tigeta here? Yes, oh, it's like and then, oh Christ, okay, well thank god people are here. Uh, in that case, get off Bavaria, oh Christ, he's gone. Yeah. Uh, do you mind going on England? Who? Uh, Oaken, Oaken Fernand. He isn't here either. Oh, God. <laughs> he's in the other VC, yeah. No yeah. one's here, everyone's like... Absolute scam, right. So what you're actually proposing... Oh, right. no, um, no, no, that's Chris, you've been promoted to England. I'm gonna do the second. I'm gonna Oh, never mind, he's here. Excellent. Oh. Congratulations. Um, no, Bavaria, you be promoted. Bavaria, you come back from the ashes, you're promoted to Castile. Oh, God. Yo, France. Castile's coming back next week, I think. Promoted to Castile? Yep. Is that really a promotion? Why didn't we all switch to room four? Is that really and a promotion? I, well, it is now. Congratulations. Austria, um, uh, Austrian player. Poland is going to be in half an hour late and uh, Rip Caravan, so... Yo, 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 friends. My, uh, my boy, friend. Caravan. Yeah, I, I'm taking Caravan Reason's on a Caravan dead. trip. Yo, yo, friends. Kinda oh. dead. Uh, on the topic oh, of... Uh, are you so he's not dead, person? I think. As what, a super what? person, congratulations. You're promoted to Caravan. Ca no, wait. Oh, so the Georgian player arrived. I'm not sure, but I've heard rumors, so you might as well go on there just in case you have 
Well, well I, just in case I'm still going to be on Georgia, if he does arrive, I'll go Caraman, but if he doesn't... That forces Cork would re because then you have to leave. Yeah. Um, uh, so France. My, my uh, well, I could do Unready and just oh. Caraman. Hey, uh, Castile. Caraman. Yo, Castile, how are you doing? Right. Um, my, my friends. What, what, what's up, guys? Also, uh, <laughs> what's up? Where is uh, Mobak? Castile, how do you feel He's about the French? Reward. Like, deep wow. down. Okay. The French are my greatest friends. Oh, no, I I feel. Are you sure about that, Castile? I am are a you different saying that? Person. Are you saying that because of diplomacy, you or are you saying that you right now? Because I, I you actually that like the French, because, because deep down, I know you hate Navera. those dirty, dirty Frenchmen. I, well, I don't want a death war. Okay, okay. Savoy. I hear. Good luck. Wait, like. what? Wait, who? Savoy. Oh. Yo, but France, yo, you, my friend. My friend. It, it, it is me, Castile. <laughs> I'm Just scared. Castile, you're doing all right? No. Uh, do you switch I'm to not. Again? Trying to organize this is fun. Do you switch, switch to Switch again? guy, what? Is he's, uh, right? he's in Austria. Wait. Oh, he's in Austria. Okay, so there you go. So, yeah, did the Austria player change? No. no, don't worry. Okay, um. I and think we waited long just... enough. We waited long enough. If they're late, they're late. Yeah, um, they so do be too late. We go enjoy, the, enjoy the uh, empty land around you. Um, yeah, no problem. Do you want to just not murder me, France? Like, <laughs> uh, uh, France, Mom, please don't. Oh, actually, where's Mobak? I say this because I'm scared. Yeah, I say that. I say, where yes. is Mobak? He's in the There we go. Hey, Mobak. Yeah, I mean that's that's Mo Mobak. What since, I have to do. Since okay. I think you're dead here. Uh, you have the choice now of being promoted to, uh, Caraman. I need... Hungry... The Mr. AI Hungry is gonna hold me hostage in this war, though. Uh, no, they won't. Yes, in fact, Marbak will... They'll probably peace out sooner rather than later. Marbak, please, you've been promoted to, uh, to Caraman, and we're off. Did that player leave? Uh, well, he didn't show up and he gave me a ping, so that's his fault for not even telling me he's not gonna show up. So congratulations, you promoted to Caraman. Okay, so not I can take bad. it over for like yep. permanently. Yep. If he shows up, I'll have to give him another tag because that's your fault for not. Having. Okay, so will Bowen be left alone in the war, or uh, uh who's Serbia? Uh, no, to turn oh. order. Uh, to turn order. Because uh, Austria can hold him in the war. Okay. I mean. I mean, the, the whole the whole goal of Marbach coming back probably. to play Hungary is he was going to uncon immediately. So that uh, Austria yeah, has, has that. the piece out. Oh, okay. Um, go on, Karim, anyway, I'll tell Austria. That, I'll tell Austria, that'll be fair. Uh, hi, Austria. Uh, on day one, uh, Marbach is going on another tag because Hungary's basically dead. And Oh, wait, Marbach is already playing this place. He's Karaman. Okay, well, but, I'm yeah. not going to be uh, Austria. That Austria. I'm, I'm going to be taking Circassia because... Right. Easy. Okay. Can I? Is, does Austria speak or not? I have no idea. Excellent. Well, is it Austria here? Yeah, here. He's, I believe Austria he's, here. Oh yeah, there you go. He can speak. Okay. Yeah. Hello, Mr. Austrian man. He spoke. That's what. Speak. Right. Hi. Uh, day one. Uh, because we're oh. moving um, Hungary over, and Hungary will be AI. The white piece Dutons. Yo, don't okay. we need a Poland more than a? Car? We have a Poland who's going to be late. So yes. Oh. Yeah. That's why. <laughs> right. So, uh, but yeah, otherwise, because of the hungry condition from earlier, he says that ally would die. So for that, he white peace Teutons. Is there a Bohemia? So. There's no Bohemia. Is no, there? it's a it's a subject. Uh, yeah, Austria Players is white peace Teutons. <laughs> Austria is going to white peace Teutons. Right. Okay, nice. Uh, Fantastic. Mob back ready up, and we'll be off. All right. Poland will be here, but late. I like being out of the 14 year regency. I can actually, you know, so, are you wars. Wait, me? Yeah, that, that truce is going to be so short. But... Uh, I'm sure you can find other player allies, but I mean, an on point hungry isn't going to be much help, I'll tell you that much. Uh, he won't be able to take that much from you because yeah, he will get yeah. AE from. Yeah, that's true. He also has loads of AE from Brandenburg, etc. And now yeah. there's a semi nation fixed Bavaria that's. Uh, well, actually, not that much of a place to but there we go. 
Fun, fun, fun. Right, well, you know what you're all doing. Have fun. I'll be unpausing shortly. I'm just going to give a couple minutes to everyone to sort out the tax. Anyway. All right. Okay. Well, that was a not fun experience, which I would not recommend to anyone, but there we go. Well, at least we are going to be off soon. Well, this is now a lot emptier, but yeah, Poland will be coming back, and Serbia, unfortunately, because they couldn't keep Hungary alive, is kind of dead here. So there we go. Germany's going to be a lot nicer and easier for Platinate and Ockenferno to consolidate. Nice thing with that, of course, consolidation-wise, it will actually pose somewhat of a threat. Although we are probably going to see a very Austria-dominated empire, which will be rather interesting. Italy is starting to get consolidated, and this will be an interesting trade-off, so we'll see how that goes. Anyway, I actually do want to check the state of Castile. In fairness, no debt. A bit of corruption, that's an understatement. Up on Miltech. And they have gone through quantities, so... That's nice for manpower supply. Fort Smith exists. And Catalonia has been annexed by Fort Yates. So that'll be a thing. They will be able to also form Spain militarily. And Amitech 10. Yep. There we go. So, so far, so good. They have nicked this uh, Portuguese fort, making the next Portuguese war easier. Although they are allied with the French. So that will probably not be a trivial endeavour for them. But we shall see how that goes. Don't this any other year. I need to put that one, but there we go. Uh, no, Josh, Josh, I said. But there we go. Right, well, with that, we'll be off. Christ, what a beautiful mess. And I guess another interesting question is what state is Caraman in? Uh, ideas could certainly be better, and institutions are there, but Miltech exists, and oof. I've seen bigger armies, but there they go, they're landing on Cyprus to get themselves that. Right, then last day didn't do too great. Compare that to, shall we say, Georgia. Oh, that's uh, not the greatest economy either, but at least they have a... At least they have an army and and that decent manpower supply in Christ, yeah, an economy that really is struggling, but it is what it is. Beyond that, techs are actually fine. They've opened two into quantity as well, so that'll be interesting. I think Kazan is the only Well Oh they have gone defense? Interesting, not going through to colonize this with a colonist. Hmm. Going for super early defensive and not grabbing this. That's a very interesting play. Very interesting play indeed, to say the least. But it is what it is. I honestly thought they would be grabbing this. Very much the play in this area, I would argue. But it is, again, what it is for the fifth time over. Ah, uh, of course, due to some Lithuania. That, yeah, that would. That would do it, unfortunately. What state of Lithuania? Ah, uh, Teutons will be not a pushover for them, unfortunately. Oh, but they have got an AI Poland. Which is. Um... Oh, wait, do it. Of course, AI Poland being a bit. Rude here and deleting half their army, although wow, very passionately going through quantity, I'll tell you that much. Well, there we go, that would be interesting, unfortunately, a bit harder for the Teutons, but of course they are Poland in the equation, it's a lot easier for them in the death war situation to peace out Poland. Although we shouldn't have to wait and see how that works for them. Burgundy here will probably be yeah, Dutch War for Independence. Uh, right. Yeah. Rain has course here, oh they do, interesting. Hmm. Do another rain, of course, then. And there we go. Right, I think the real uh, comeback, as it were, is Portugal has managed to at least grab themselves. 
They've accepted Ristinian. Four percent of their country, and that's fair. Try and maximize it. Oh wow! <laughs> it's also oh, oh my god, that's so strong. That's actually so strong. I mean, it's fish, which is not the best, but still, on temp reduction, even a non-trivial amount. Oh, that's actually cost them thirty that of their country. Spent trying to govern Tenerife, but yeah, New World Empire will be the thing that's carrying them forward here. 37 force summit and that, and an actually decent economy, although really not great, is merely 5 tax. Probably up to 7 by the time that thing is done, but still. Still equivalent to Spain, so actually, yeah. Trade has been very hurt in this area. That's the main thing. The Spanish have taken their slices. Oh dear, they are also going to be entering the Spanish Civil War. Which is... Yeah. Hmm. Not the best. Huh, and this does give them restorations in... Ooh, that's an interesting play, though. They do have a kill switch as they were in Portugal, so... Yeah. Hmm. There we go. That'll be interesting to see how they go for it. And intervene. That's a fair point. Anyone can intervene on the Teutons to quote unquote save them here now with Poland in it, but. And so the Teutons are treating this as a bit of a death hole, which they are, in fairness, probably correct to do. Now that they have just walked off the back of a terrible attempt to keep uh, them alive. And okay, it seems that the gold mine has been secured by the Austrians, so good for them. They've skewed all the gold. And this one's actually been nicely dead for them as well. Someone's actually losing to Byzant AI Byzantium. Always a uh, interesting uh, dilemma, but there we go. For uh, Byzantium, of course, only be able to recover the risk. They've all had to kill the Polish, but there we go. Mm, it is what it is. It is, after all, just AI. Go back in with the Teutons. I think they'll be able to beeline and peace out the Polish unless the Lithuanians are ready to start dropping. Some pretty insane contributions to the war, and they kind of are. They're a. Ooh, that's not. Our maintenance, that's just in general a lot of interest and a terrible economy. Christ almighty. It's a terrible economy, but I guess that can be said for almost everyone. I think France is probably the country with. I guess Florence, sorry. Yeah, 28, something reasonable. But I believe, yeah, probably Florence, I think, is the best one here. You can add a decent living in England. Yeah, 33. That's very impressive, this area. Especially since they have spawned faceting here. So this province alone is making them a decent three ducats. And that's just in trade value. But we shall see how that goes for them. They are kind of sharing the node as well as Savoy, so... Don't know how much they want to get along with that, or if they want to migrate to Venice. Not a bad idea, but not a great one either. Into economic second, which is interesting because the policy isn't great, but I'm assuming they're doing this because they will be taking quantity third for supply. But there we go. Next policy in defensive is this one. It is a nice one to get because it's this one's been slightly buffed. Oh, another thing, actually, offense. So I did remember I did buff it. Uh, recruitment time is down to 25%, not minus 10. So, if you have offensive and you recruit things, you recruit them a lot faster. It's actually a more substantial change, I would argue, but there we are. How are the Teutons doing? Uh, I think this is a bit brave. They are definitely asking Lithuanians to come in for a fight here, but Lithuanians are very content to siege them out. Otherwise. <laughs> if anything, this is mostly given Kazan a breather, who's definitely taken this opportunity to get some more slices of land. Down into, well, Circassia to this area. And there we go, the conquest against Gazi Kimura. It's going to end, well, not well for Gazi Kimura, I'll tell you that much. I don't think administrative ideas are the way to go, guys. Gazi, I'll be honest. You're not going to be core on a lot of things, you'll be mostly dying. But yeah, oh, of course, oh, of course, yeah. I. Yeah, I can't do this. It, it can't. It, it's actually literally cheating right now. 
just to clarify this. <laughs> we, we did it. We've caught, it, caught the AI shooting in 4K. A player cannot do this. It cannot send a command to go to the Kazan capital with this army because it doesn't know where the Kazan capital is. I guess this isn't even the Kazan capital. Oh, let me guess they're going to a fort. No, they are just going to here for some reason. Never mind. The AI is just shooting for no reason. They shouldn't be able to know that that province exists, but they're going to it anyway. Great. <laughs> Honestly, it's by the time they arrive and do anything, because that's going to have free occupations. So that's the game for them, but still. Ah, checking back in with how the Teutons are doing, and... Well, there goes the Livonian Order, and they're actually getting knocked out of great power, and there's the bankruptcy looming. But... They're probably going to have the Polish out of this soon. I'm thinking of getting the Polish out of this soon. Is they probably able to ooh, take max money? That'll last them actually around 20 months, which could be mean a lot. Oh, but there's an Anquan. Oh, I'm looking at Great Power Status. So it's occupied first. But there's the white piece that they wanted. And oops, long. What happened to you there? Okay. Oh, it's B2, my bad. Yep. Mm -hmm. Oh, they took that fort. Oh, and they're going to go fight there. Probably in Riga, I guess. Yeah, into forests. Probably a decent fight to take. As well, when they've gone with quality. Early quality is an interesting play. It's significantly weaker now, but still. Definitely are being, going to be able to punch quite well overall. And there we go. The Wainia runs off the siege. Unfortunately, it's not a fort in, that they control, so this will not be unseated for them, but still something and with the walls and breach there and riga exists with their 1k men on that <laughs> oh we got a good air oh we didn't see it. and that was not a greater success to say the least unfortunately oh well are they successfully scared of the Lithuanians? the issue is what the thing is going to do now deal with their rebels smart idea at first <laughs> Smart idea indeed. And ah, bash grid. Yeah. I think they were slightly reliant on gold. Look at the uh, looks at the inflation, but there we go. What? Right. How are the French doing then? Well, not paying for all of their forts and unseaching Paris. So there we go. Reasonable economy. That's not actually gold based, but yeah, mostly tax and production. So. Probably the only naturally uh, rich country this straight. The other thing as well to ask is how are the English doing? Because uh, that's not very well, that's not very well at all. Okay, they've scrambled back together the fleet. So nice for them. Four heavies is something. And only three loans, but they are bankrupt. Up to eighty one, so those particulars are going to be having a field day. Also about to enter the peasants' war, which is not a fun one to be in either. Christ, not a lot of good things going for you there, England, are they? Um, oh yeah, my power recovery is down the toilet because of bankruptcy and Scotland's actually disloyal, which is an unfortunate event. But there we go. Yeah, they're going to need to do a lot of recovering to be able to contend onto the uh, onto the continent again. But at least they have their Calais. And for now, at least some chunk of the English Channel, although honestly that chunk is evolving a lot. Yeah, all, all the sense of trade got downgraded, of course. Bankruptcy, so... Queensland and Holland are getting a nice chunks of the English Channel for themselves. Hmm. Well, somehow Paraman had... What, how did they let that run? I am so confused. Did their Navy get beaten up? It's about to say... Surely not. Why do you not let your own navy repair? Well, I guess it's just one boat, but still. Hmm. Kind of ironic that they can't defeat Cyprus then. <laughs> it doesn't bode well for them. Anyway, as for the Teutons, how are they doing? Are they going to get to that peace with... The Poles? Ooh, rather soon, actually. And they're probably seeing that's just their only opportunity to take a land here, so they might take a little slice. Mm, looks like it. They can also take a decent chunk of money now. 
can actually take land, funny enough. But there we go. Right. Lithuanians, however, they're getting back. Oh, that's what they were looking at to relieve that. But now they're both dropping here to. Oh, yeah, deal with this. Support of rebels. Really a smart idea. Also, Genoa still exists here. Are they in the Empire or something? Probably not. No, they're not. Okay, I was about to say the only state province in the world. Producing 0.65 out of 0.64 states in the entire world because paradox map, but there we are. Oh, yeah, these caravan got themselves on to basically. Half the silks in the world, I'm really creating some... No, they're not, it's Georgia. Who I'm assuming has devved their silk. Not really, now you've got a workshop on it, but still. Simply because it's in their state that isn't on fire. They are not even trading in silk. Who the hell is trading in silk? <laughs> Probably a Sylvania, actually. Yeah, they are. They're trading in slaves and silk. Quite an interesting combination, but there we go. Oh yeah, trading in slaves. Gotta get that global tariffs up for all those colonies we have. But there we are. Right. Teutons getting a bit of their land back. I'm not really sure what they are going to be doing here. Time is not on their side. You just start getting some... Oh. Oh, yawning. My oh, apologies. Honestly, you should probably peace out Poland sooner rather than later before they hot join back in. And then start working from that before. But it is what it is. How is Josh just doing on Sylvania here? Oh, well, again, clean up rebels. He knows times on his side he can let the uh, Moldovians and Polish to uh, do the sieging for him. Although his economy is also not great, at least it's not full decimal mode. So that's always something. Okay, he did not take the personal union as well, so... But he did take gold and liberty, so yeah, that's always quite nice. Hoping the Polish sort out these Byzantine separatists for sooner rather than later, but there we go. Hey, Byzantium's grown, poor thing. Christ. What a mess. How are the Florentines doing then? Well, economically, so far, so good. And that's some interesting expansion here into Malia, Romania. Not consolidated either, but I guess I don't want to. They actually want to keep that dev. Once they're still the capital, and they haven't taken Rome, but I'm seeing it's because they haven't gone policy yet. We have a burger coup, but it's fine to keep them loyal and. All right, for the dev cost, really. Let's leave it there, we are. Again, what's most surprising is, oh yeah, there is the rip to uh, Gaspar Murish, is um, they did not go into expansion to grab the colonists to pick up the slant here. I really, really thought they would. I guess they've been struggling to exist for a while, so that's probably why. And why are they fighting Orthodox Evans? Should honestly just go off, in my opinion, but there we are. Mm, it is what it is. But okay, the Teutons, I mean, they definitely have the way to peace out the Polish here. If they just did on Warsaw, that would be... They can already take... Christ, they can actually already take a very decent chunk. If, with the siege of this province, they can take 33, so... 
probably looking at war effort max money if I was, was me, because I probably wanted to continue that war effort, but there we are. The Lithuanians, of course, very... Oh, they are coming back in full force. Of course, but more to siege out the Teutons than anything. Do they want to take a fight in Krakow? No, that is farmlands. Uh, but it seems that the Teutons are not going to be particularly keen on that fight either. Mainly because I think, yeah, they've seen the Lithuanian army, so they're finally going to take a fight with it, I'm assuming. Well, I guess we'll find out. Really, I'm surprised they're just not saying screw it and piecing out the Polish. But, mm, it is what it is. Alright. So, with that, how is Friesland doing? I've taken over as a sub, and actually, surprisingly, not too bad. I've taken a 20% chunk of the English Channel, actually, top of the pile there was just merely us, Friesland. I guess they are protecting trade. Reasonable expansion into Germany. And a free stab never hurts. A couple of slower subjects, but again, who isn't? An alliance to the player and part of it, so so far so good. Oh Christ England. Maybe just uh old peasants war oh lord. 10% crown land. It's not pretty. This is not pretty to go through. Well, at least this will mean the peasants war will end. And losing 100 prestige when you're that far low on prestige and stab. Yeah. Honestly, they're going to break anyway. Well, that's a missing icon for you there. Surprising. Come on, Paradox, fix your game. But there we are. Very, very... It wasn't for an APW completely gone now. But I believe they're truce with the French, actually. They are until 88. So actually, yeah, they're relatively fine. Ah, look that. There we go. There goes that army, unfortunately. The peasants are going to be uh, defeating the starving English. Well, rest in peace, the starving English army. Also, the peasants are going to be uh, taking control of you there. Which, of course, are for some reason very Irish. Very Irish indeed. They're almost. Yeah. How many people in the state not culture convert him? You might as well just state at this point. I mean, I'll be honest with you, just accept them. If you accept the English, you the peasants, that's This is painful, but play it. You, you do have to basically accept both of these right now. The autonomy is gonna be brutal for you and your entire crown ladder is gone, but you do have the English Navy. I don't know why you're not... Why you're going to let them break you instead of just accepting. I mean, in 13 months as they inform... Enforce. You may as well accept them now. But hey, at least they're... Yeah. Not the prettiest country in the world, but there we go. And how did you don't I think they finally pieced out the Polish. Yes, they have. And judging by the end of by the lens of that truth. In 86 they took a decent chunk of war score actually. And ooh, they're gonna go in here. That's woods. I was gonna say that'd be brave to go into there, but there we go. They have lost the wood fort. But it is what it is. Polish war app. 
Yeah, no, that's starting to be a problematic, and this starts going to Polish. Oh no, they're bankrupt. Oh lord. Well, at least they finished quantity. Woo. Reasonable force of an increase, but there we go. The means of Byzantine rebels will actually break because they're not going to be able to deal with them. <laughs> Unfortunate. Yep. Also, the British player said he would be late, but he's not actually showing up, so... Oopsie daisy. <laughs> I'm sure whatever it is, it'll be fine. At the end of the day, it's just a very interesting dynamic over here anyway. A much more empty land off over in the east. Means that uh, Tigeta will get a bit of a uh, a bit of a break as he consolidates himself into a uh, Ford Russia. It's like a golden horde, but worse. And there we are again. I'm still very surprised he took defense here. I guess it's more of a survival thing, but it is what it is. Also, 21 years will we will be seeing the spawn of colonialism somewhere. Goodness knows where. Ah yes, Naples did spawn it here, so yay. And, oh, he's in the Empire. Well, that's a boon for Austria at least. I guess it's more of a gives him a chance to eat. But doesn't this give him a state in the Empire? Yes, yeah, especially the Emperor. That is not pretty. I guess it also does give him more utility and rather hit down him in, within the Empire. But there we go. Oh, that's nice of him. And of course he's trading the gems, the other main gems from his being here. But at the 9 production, there's really not much to compete with Siena's 13 and a workshop. That was, that was definitely a workshop here. No, not even a workshop. Yeah, that would do it. What I unfortunately missed is why has Josh just, just given up this fort? Now well, given it was by lesser morale, it seems that he didn't and I just missed the battle like an idiot. <laughs> and, but yeah, I think it definitely would not be a pushover here and when he started the war, he's probably going to have to give up some land to feed them here as well. Fridge. This is never pretty. Now, of course, I would love to desire prettier borders. So something like this would be excellent, but you know, it's going to be honestly something horrible like that in a total victory war weapon max money. Just the Teutons taking themselves a nice slice, but in in the Polish go again. This time relieving Eve. Well, let's say that from the Lithuanians' perspective. Ah, uh, sorry, the Lithuanians are going in again to relieve the siege. From the Lithuanian perspective, a bit less morale. And, uh, but a discipline advantage because of a strict ruler. It was a 9 as well early, but... Tudon's certainly trying to hold their own. But it's going to take a while for that, those troops to get there. And I think they're going to win this, I'm afraid. Yes, they are. Well, they retain control of that fort, and that's a costly loss for the Tudons, who doesn't, don't exactly have much in terms of manpower. But I've seen this is mostly mercs anyway. Yes, it is. Yes, yes, it really is. Okay. Oh, there we go. Also, wow, the rain. You are really taking bites out. And you can take all this and... I mean, do it on the ear tick and you'll be fine. <laughs> but, yeah, of course, yeah, I won't do that, so it'll probably be something like this. And war weapon money. 485 ducats actually for an AI this this size would be quite substantial. But there we are. And a quailer popped out. It's rebels. And an Austrian core, I'd assume so, Christ. Well the prettiest sight. And those are Byzantine separatists, which means they think they're about to. Breaking 56. Christ, that is a uh, resurgent Byzantium. I've seen it, and that's an AI of resurgent Byzantium at that. They are fighting against a AI Naples, which is interesting and 
they're separatists slaughtering the uh, enemies, but there we go. We only have 5k men though. Yeah, they probably should build some more to deal with this, but there we go. Oh, a recipe for Peace Purple Phoenix. Why are they getting corruption? Of course they're getting corruption. I'm, oh, I'm disappointed. Right, how are the Jukons doing? Ah, uh, less well. Someone's stuck on the side end, but I think I can sneak out through the side, especially if they march this army into uh, gold again. Probably hold here for a while. I mean, how picked up? Yeah, everything very. Uh, not gone greedy for the dev course, they picked up morale. I've got a monastic order as well, which is quite nice for fort maintenance, but does stick them out of it. Now, this fort maintenance is 20%, and you thought it would be very interesting to stack with a defensive uh, buff fort maintenance. So that would be 45% of forts, which is rather substantial. Remember, there we go. Oh, also, the Swedish are finally getting themselves a slice of Norway. So, yeah. We'll see how that goes. And that brings me to another point, actually. How is the reform desire? Not great. It will be a while before they can do anything with that. But it is what it is. Beyond that... Oh, at least the AI managed to... And siege their own fort. Oof. Almost. But if anything else is going to do is give them more years of separatism. They're bankrupt until 83 anyway, so past that, they'll probably be fine. Although they entered Peasants' War, that probably means they'll break the Peasants. And it seems they're going to be entering Peasants' War. 81. Yeah. Bankruptcy. Uh, yeah, we get past two there. Well, it is what it is, and hey, Florence has acquired access through that coast as well. Probably will be competing with the Austrians now, a much more substantial threat for Italian hegemony. But yeah, surprised they, I guess they can form Tuscany, they just haven't. Mission-wise, anything they really want to pop? What's this, Agni, Mali, Romagna, yeah. Lombardy, Dreams of Grandeur. Front the Lombards. That's not anything permanent. That's not anything permanent. That is a nice one. That's actually, oh my god, 50% local tax. That's actually... Because yeah, they could sort of answer this and actually going to move to death this 15 times. It's kind of ironic. Not sure what that does, but there we go. Hmm. This is actually... Ooh, that is really nice, though. That is pretty good at that. Are they within that? Oh, yeah, the one. That fun stuff. It's a very unfun disaster, but also not actually a terrible one. I wouldn't, I would, it's good as a disaster, but it doesn't really work like one, I guess. It's a better way of putting it. It's very event-driven as well, from what I've heard. Got a backup of lines and guaranteed by them. Well. well. At least the voice expanding well, and Christ, they still Geneva. Kind of supported by Naples, yeah. I'm not sure how much Naples will be able to do to help them. But it is what it is. Right. Okay, Teutons, I'll be honest with you, that's not starting to look too good. But yet again, okay, never mind. I'll have to go home to fight Rome. Yeah, Lithuania could be a, uh, a more stable country, shall we say, I guess they've... Uh... Their expansion into Novgorod and so on, they've really overextended themselves, to say the least. Is that form Russia? So they reform out of Steppy Nomads. Hmm. 
But there we go. And reap the benefits of a just and broken localization. Thank you, Paradox. Oh. One day. One day I'll be a finished game. But there we go. Scash is still up for grabs, so they probably have more fires of their own to put out. But in all fairness, I think they're relatively fine. Manpower, of course, hurts. They're severely underforced them, but otherwise, so far, so good. Especially given the amount of death force they have to fight. Oh well. I'm surprised that Portugal or Castile is making a move here. I guess Portugal is sitting here building up money. Christ, I think that temple's over. And yep, and they've gone for the workshop and the barracks as well, so. Trying to grab everything they can out of Tenerife for this train, which is fair enough. Like 8.6 ducats is nothing to frown about. Kind of funny they've accepted the uh, Rusinians here. From here, 224. Ooh. They can uh, change their primary culture. Away, but yeah, nice. Definitely cheaper to just accept it. it does also mean that provinces there will be getting uh, Rustinian separatists. There we go. Alright, I believe that's our Poland. It's finally taking the liberty to arrive a mere hour late, but there we go. This country got um. This I is the worst like, time to be at war. Oh yeah, no. hello. Uh, Mr. Fortune Man, man you did I'm go playing bankrupt. on a tech Easter Cassia. Just wanted to let y'all know that Byzantium and Naples are at war for control of, like, oh, fucking no. Avarice. Oh, no. Yeah. yeah. It's oh, over. and, um, yeah, Byzantium rebels are not close to enforcing, but you're bankrupt and about to enter peasants' war, so. Poland, Poland please, 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 please let the Byzantine rebels do their thing. Yeah. We all have to pop the mission restore Greece, in fairness, but there we go. Wait, no, I want to keep Poland should accept Wait. demands. AI Poland has been similar. Is, is Byzantium a player? No. Okay, it's what? A it's so a country. What the fuck? Yeah, yeah, Byzantium it's is just AI. Yeah. This, this oh my god. It's been, it's been AI probably. the entire time. What, Chad? Yeah, okay. Yep. Yep, there we go. Chad, Chad Byzantium. We Big all want to see Byzantium Chad. get big as fuck. Can we all yes. just agree to yes. let Whenever Byzantium see the player on Byzantium. Oh, right, fuck. Uh, I agree. To, to the thing. Treat, treat ah, Byzantium like Caraman's a fucking player. player. Oh yeah, the Byzantine rebels have gone. Caraman killed them. Is the game like resumed? Yep. Do I even have an army? What the f I don't. Okay, I'm oh, like. Yeah, Alright, right, Sir Cat. Right right I don't, I don't uh, have Sir Cat. No, no, I, no, I don't have an army. Recover. Have fun. It's time to. Wait, time this is to this is impossible. I, I have... Uh, you are an hour late, I'm sorry, I couldn't find a sub. This is an imposter oh, no, yeah. <laughs> no, but I, I have, I have done, 800 done. manpower. Yeah, I have literally 800 manpower. How did the AI lose his band? Uh, the Teutons, you... The Lithuanians called them in against the war against the Teutons. The Teutons really beat them up, took max money, took war out. Oh, you're playing I, war I, I joined in a war, and your army was already gone with mine. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Let me... Oh, only oh, two longs. That's... That's not too bad. Yeah, you just came out of bankruptcy. We just can tell by your stability or lack thereof. Oh fuck! Oh, there we go. I'm sure he'll be fine. Right. I still be getting to couple stay minutes in the empire. The However, but, the but, decision but, to form Sardinia Piedmont, um, like, makes you leave the empire. So, is there some way for me to rejoin after taking that decision? You have to become, Just become an elector. Uh, I mean, what's your death? If you're well, if you're I, safe. If you're my death currently is 197. How is Castile um, doing? Uh, they're absolutely fine. If you I mean, want, I can kill off an elector right. next As long as it's below 200, you can... But yeah, sorry, before enough, Poland, just to clarify, um, mm. you have finished quantity ideas, it's fine. I, that would I mean I, that... I, <laughs> I right, there we go. But to answer your question, uh, let's check in how Castile is doing. Well, in all fairness, uh, could be a lot worse. 
Uh, but I had to put Ryan on it because the person who said he was subbing it didn't sh uh, couldn't show up. So there we go. I I don't know if you recognise them from anything, but there we go. Also, uh, Aragon has been subjugated by Florence, so I think this French have a plan here. We don't know what it is, but I think they have a plan here. But it's okay. You've almost finished integrating uh, Catalonia. Your economy is existent. You're starting to work through the corruption. Uh, you are at force them and just not paying for the troops, and you have a decent amount of them. You've gone quantity economics, so you have the policy sooner rather than later. And so far, so good. 23 income is very respectable compared to the Portuguese. 20, and don't forget, Portugal's got that massive amount of income. Yeah, well, it was that or no one, so there we go. Uh, ten, remember, Portugal has Tenerife, so it's actually impressive they only got that much going for them. But there we go. Either way, I'm sure you'll be fine. Right. Let's get going. Yeah, again, it was it was that or no one, so... There you go. <laughs> However, the world is still pretty crowded, Christ. They are pretty here, but... Yeah, Byzantine Separatists, I think, will be... Oh, dear. Yeah, that's fair. Uh, assuming that's a crash. Well, I would be assuming so anyway, but there we go. What a mess. Beautiful mess, then. <laughs> Enjoy being dead. Right. I don't, don't want to leave a uh, dead France, right? Take... Anyone oh, would be Polish? Uh, are you, still on? No. Are you uh, I'm no. assuming, temporary crash, right? What at the moment? Epsilon's not here. <laughs> what? France. France crashed. Oh no, no one's not here. No. That's not good. Araman already uh, sent me peace offer. Should I accept? It's okay, I got you. I'll sub for France. I got you. No, I, I get are you actually here? What? Yes. I, okay, uh, rejoin when you can. I kept the pause. Wait, Rios? He's still I've in the game. Paused. Bro. He's not in the game. You've... I'm still in the game. Leave the game. I'm just. I'm just. It's because the game is paused. That's why we think he's still in the game. He hasn't updated for us. Did... He's not Should I game. just peace out, Karen? Yeah, he's still in the game. Epsilon. I can play map mode. Oh, great. Oh. Immediately. Oh, <laughs> immediately. So I'm still in. All right, rehost. No, no rehose. No, I don't want to rehose when they, we need a rehose. The Why do we rehose? Rehose is cringe. Yeah, yes, it's either that one I'm playing, so. Alright, just rehose. I'm afraid. Uh, I guess so... we don't have to play. It's Rip. either that or being cringe. That's fine. It looks like we're going to be. It looks like it's going to be finally our March of the Eagles MP. I just want to attack. I have only one mission in life, and that's make sure I never ship consolidate. Oh, so wait, I... I have I the 12th largest created. army, that's Pog. There's 12 countries left. <laughs> I got oh. booted, I'm gonna have to rejoin. No, that's it. Uh, everyone did, I'm rehosting. I'm okay. afraid. Rehost, rehost, don't be the bad host. Alright, so same, what, 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 what lobby? Patience, uh, my well, guy. It is still not right now. I'm being patient, just, just waiting. <laughs> so, uh, how how was everyone's day? Yeah, it's a lobby. Hello, rehost lobby up. Yeah. Hello, rehost and lobby is up. Yeah. Okay, hello, I'm back to the main one. Ooh, right. Just need At least I won that battle before it crashed. 
I just I'm gonna look. Please shift consolidate. It's for your own good. You know you want to take the shift consolidate. Term, consider you are up. But I don't ask me ask the game. Okay. Because I, I went into what the game folder considers Europe and continents, and I added those provinces manually back in. I'm going to be honest, I have no clue what this mod changes the game. Uh, quantity got nerfed, defensive got slightly buffed, quality got slightly nerfed, um, age bonuses Nerf. got changed. Okay, 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 what did you say that got buffed? Defensive. Defensive, okay, I'm gonna take defensive next. I don't know if you should. It's most, well, I mean, again, defensive. What I buffed there is fort maintenance and fort defensive. What, what do you change for defensive? The morale? No, 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 no. Fort, the morale is still the same. The fort defense has been up and fort maintenance has been decreased. Further. Oh! Oh. Offensive oh. ideas, troop recruitment is slightly faster. So some more, small little things, but quantity got hard enough. 25% national force limit and 25% manpower now instead of 50. Um. Oh yeah, country ideas got changed. I've added Tenerife um, as a promise modifier for a new world empire. I've done a lot of things. Okay. Uh, what Next else can stuff. I say? <laughs> oh yeah, there's also some nice stuff right of Kazan. Uh, basically, in the five Siberian provinces that are considered part of Europe, literally part of the Siberian trade node, though, I've all given them Siberian uh, Sib wealth of Siberia modifiers. Given yeah, so what you're telling me is that I have to see those modifiers. Sorry? Because that. Kazan can colonize. Those five, That's yeah. bug. And Tenerife has a uh, has a problem fire called uh, New World Empire, which if you hold Tenerife, you get a very nice bonus. It's like 25% force of them. And very nice. I just, see, I just scroll down to Tenerife and they see a mega city there. It's what there, is yeah. the devil? Oh yeah, also oh, I was not particularly sober when I was coding it. And so someone, I forgot who convinced me, oh yeah, make it Rustinian culture. So it's now also a Rustinian. Amazing. Uh, that explains things. <laughs> oh yeah, there's uh, there's some unintended consequences. Like for example, slaves. The only slaves producing provinces as of. Oh, you're talking about slaves again? I see. Yeah, Wait, what, happened what I meant is, slaves? and the only what two happened? provinces in the world that produce gems are Siena, where spawn Fasting, and Konigsberg. Konigsberg. Spurgeon, yeah. And yeah. there's only two provinces in the world that produce silk, one in Georgia and one in uh, the Ottos. Like wait, 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 no, which province? Silk. Which province in Georgia? The Silk? Uh, one of the mountain ones. Okay. I think I have silk. No, you don't. There's only two Milan silk. has an event silk. where they can spawn oh, no, 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 silk, not silk in Como, silk but they're not going to take it this game. Why not? Because I'm, like, eating Milan and they're not going to have the prereqs. No. Aww. Just oh. let them take the event. <laughs> Please, don't be mean with Milan. And Barcelona gets one, they can spawn so can Barcelona, but I think uh, Ar but I don't think Aragon's going to take that. Unless Aragon gets, unless Boron. Okay, Aragon's I have a question. What the hell happened with Catalonia and Aragon? <laughs> uh, so Aragon was a player, they death ward Ar Castile, they lost. I did that, yeah. And then I, I... Um, they lost land, and then Catalonia was released, was uh, taken, and Aragon released Catalonia as a subject and fed them Aragon. That's that's a smart, actually. Because Wait, Aragon's rebels. still a player. What a chad. But there we go. It's kind of like the China situation. Catalonia. And now the Aragon player scene. is subbing still. Would like to point that out. <laughs> there are two Aragons. One of them is small. And one is big. Oh no! It's Taiwan all over again. Uh, I'm going to ask you. Of... Not only has Taiwan been removed, but so has the entirety of China. Yeah, but so we created oh, yeah, United as one country, not exist. Yeah, but we created our own with Catalonia and Aragon. <laughs> look at look at Aragon, <laughs> Catalonia. <laughs> Basically, the whole China situation, but we no. did it ourselves DIY. Yeah. Make your own China. Make your own. This China. is such a missing this UK, is such a weird Western UK, Mediterranean. Missing yeah, uh, missing UK. Like like Islands, alive. Florence, Naples split. So speaking of the whole Castile situation, I'd really like to thank you for putting the Bavaria player there, because I was uh, contemplating the whole week how I would survive the first year in the session. Really? When oh, yeah, I was gonna murder. I don't him. think you were that far. I think you had a high force, but okay, I'm sure you'll no. be fine. Like yeah, he was Ooh, gonna murder me day one. I was in a war with AI, four of them actually. 
I had basically just one ally, and I was Both. yeah. In that was just call me Austrians, you'll be fine. Oh no, yeah, Ashu with my time. ally. No, Ash, wow. Ashu with my ally. So, Christ. They would... Well, have fun. What? Right, where's the boy? Where's England? Kind of need the England. I'll be honest with you. Right. Okay. Literally just missing England. Where's Mr. Muffs? I don't know when they're not in voice chats, but there we go. Well, he's online, so if you could actually communicate, that would be useful. Oh well. That's the rest of the piece then. Christ, for France, I thought it was so many people around it. And England and Burgundy. I guess still in Aragon, they sure have surprised survived a lot. Unfortunately, Christ is still going to be AI. Oh, they're probably going to let Scotland go free, aren't they? Oh, Lord. Behind on everything. Right. Well, I guess it's the French lucky day. Mm. Okay, and the Teutons are being beaten back again. Not pretty, but there we go. Yeah, not the Teutons finest moments. Not the Teutons finest moments indeed. I'm not sure what they intend on taking. I can't trust the Teutons fine over. Also, Karma, that's very interesting and brave Dow, given that Lithuania can come down there and sort out your entire army in one wipe. You're not even a force in fighting a player. What are you doing? What are you doing? Oh, Christ, they're in Peasant's War. Oh, there goes our troops. And there we are. Which a caravan, we should probably take this war a bit more seriously, if I'm being honest. Ooh, now that is an interesting change. Karam, really, Kazan? You have no manpower, you're five loans in. You've taken tech seven. But really. And I guess they have to, that's probably their best bet. Uh, 
And there we go. A bit of a dog pile, of course, but what isn't? Kazan. Surprised George is staying out of this, but. Oh, okay. Taking a slice of Sakashi. Fair enough, surprised I haven't done this earlier. They particularly need the forts or anything, but. I guess it's land. Got the pricing lag with mountain forts. Like, you can fort here, fort here, fort here, fort here, fort here, fort here, fort here. You're basically invincible, though, yeah, paying for them will be problematic, so. Defensive ideas maybe it would have gone well for you, but there we go. Well, it is what it is. Well, the thing you're most probably going to have to focus on one person at a time now. Yeah, someone's going to be the Teuton too. Well, I think they see it. Will they take the fighting Connorsburg? They honestly should. I think it's about as good as it gets in terms of fighting. There don't have any mountains lying around. But, still not a pretty one at that. What are we looking like? Yeah, that's very overforced. Well, it is what it is. Oh Christ! Yeah, Naples is doing a bit of a, a bit of a number on the Byzantine system at least. No, currently what's actually happening is Naples is getting absolutely stalled by the, uh, the Florence troops, so that's probably going to be nice for them. And hey, Albania got their call back. Nice. Not against Venice, of course, but at least against the Ottomans, who themselves have been basically reduced to irrelevance. Hey, at least they got the Genoese Islands, but yeah, one... Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight provinces. There's not much to call home about. Christ, Kaman only has 15k, which is not pretty. Very surprised they haven't lit up more, and again, they actually have quite a few rebel problems back at home. There is some borders as well. Considering they probably want to restore Sartre to Rome, they have everything. You buy any Ottomans not to exist. Your own. Oh, they're going to need to own a core in Eris room. So they will need to be handed at least two provinces from Georgia. And there we go, they can form a run. Which will be interesting, but there we are. Alright. I'm hoping they can negotiate some deal with Georgia here, given their own lights. Probably a sell, sell. Take will be best, because then Georgia keeps their course, but it may leave them vulnerable, because they will have to break their alliance and be truced. Well, we shall see beyond that. Oh yeah, Pona now with two player wars. Not sure where their army is, but... Honestly, not in many places, and Christ, what hold oh, gold. Dead already. Oh Christ, okay, yeah, they're gonna be approaching the second bankruptcy soon. Okay, well, unfortunately, Byzantine won't be taking that. Oh, and they peace out with Kazan as well. Well, there we go. Interesting borders eventually, but there we very interesting border choices.
Okay, he's unfortunately kind of right, unfortunately. Yeah, England is also on the sword. But at least if there's no England, that means there's no camping England there. So that would be nice. Although, yeah. Now, Fran I think the France Florence Alliance stands as the ultimate begemoth in this area. But there we go. We'll have to wait and see how that develops. But yes, more players dropping off. I think this is nice for Lithuania, if anything. But it's kind of. It does spell death still for the Teutons, unfortunately. I mean, the real winners here are how to beat Hayeta with the Marvax, so the Eastern Bloc may be the way to go forward. This is sure, even if Lithuania wins this, they're going to be able to win enough land to go. I mean, they can prevent a uh, they can prevent a Prussia, which is probably something they're very interested in doing, and uh, basically split up their land for good. But that's Scottish with half of Europe. Also, didn't they dow into the empire? Interesting. Oh, they dowed this when Austria was the war with Teutons. So yeah, this is their only chance of beating them up. The Empire Mechanics. But there we go. Well, they are in a golden age. Woo, English golden era. That's gonna go for something. They're going straight back into the planet key. Right. Well, that could have gone better for them. There's no denying that. Corruption is significant and legitimacy is non-existent. They have a Lancaster on the throat, so that's something. And then there we go. Right. Soft. Ah, uh, 75 autonomy everywhere. But there we go. And Christ the rain, you took a bite there and a half. Probably not nice for the French, given the Imperial map mode with that, but there we go either as well. Hmm. Well, that'll be interesting to see. I mean, eventually France and Austria will have to bump heads in Austria, probably on their own stance as a rather substantial power, given... Basically, I haven't taken most of their actual PUs. They have got Royal Hungary here, and once they do all of this fun stuff, they should be getting a lot of stuff going for them in that regard. They also are getting their callbacks, so yeah. There they go. Well, Sweden's also taking a bite of Novgorod. Surprised it didn't happen sooner, but there we go, and yeah, I get it, Sylvania has now. Reduced Teutons to basically the island of the Teutons, I believe. We have a decent chunk of time to go before bankruptcy, but yeah, they're taking us for death, well, there's max corruption. There it is. Hmm. Well, there they go. And there we go, Friesen's starting to consolidate some of their subjects. Brunswick now loyal, I believe? Yes, it is. Mm, almost, but yeah. Hey, Brandenburg is existent. Actually expanding, surprisingly, but there we are. So yeah, Florence is about to do a bit of a number on them. Oh no, you're gonna kill Byzantium, that's a rip. Oh well. I need to release Bulgaria, actually, that's a fair shout. That's a decent chunk of reconquest to get yourself into. But you still have to turn back to the Teutons. Okay, well, they've got that back. And they have scared them off the Siege of Regis, and that's something, but. I mean, they can keep this up for a while, is the only concern. So, this is going to hurt the Lithuanians as well. And the other thing is, bear in mind, is Lithuania has just lost a lot of land to keep this war going. Like, a lot, a lot of land. 
So my question is, are they themselves going to be approaching bankruptcy soon? And the answer is probably yes. I think Poland is kind of just doing that naturally, but there we are. Oh, but there's a battle coming for once, and it's the Teutons taking the offensive into grasslands, but they are crossing a river. Four maneuver to beat. Do they have a full maneuver pit? They do not. If you're taking the minus one. But there we go. Hmm. And it's only a one, but that still beats that zero. And they have a nicer general, especially in the shock phase, which is where it matters. But that is a nine still, unfortunately, for them. They weren't able to get away with much in that shock phase. And that is going to be incredibly tight to the wire. And just barely a win for the Teutons. Just barely. But always nice to see. And by yeah, Livonian and Livonian separatists. Just try and get Latvia to be a real country. Of course you all know that's not a real country. But yeah, economic losses are very substantial. And hey, Brandenburg separatists, woo. Brandenburg come back when? Oh, hopefully soon. Hopefully soon enough. Right, and there we go, Karaman now taking the offensive. Although Byzantium is certainly not queuing over on that one. And okay, borders here have been restored to full player only control. Well, at least Kazan took their tribute while they can. And severely decreased their force limit because, wow, they're under force. Why they need manpower. I guess fighting rebels that entire time has not been pretty for them. Hmm. It's three into defense now, so they got their bonuses to religious unity, which is rather helpful, ironically. Still surprised I haven't gone orthodox. And here's the Swedish blob on their border, so that's probably not a very awe inspiring sight as well. But, oh, they have taken Moscow. Are they going to try and switch? Christ, well, I guess we'll never know. No, we will know. How is the Gaston integration going? Better than before, down by 1487 as well. And they are true still, is. Just about everyone. Hey, they're improving. Uh, they've allied the Pope only. Oh, that's not a lot of. It's not a lot of friends there, especially in Portugal's. Breathing down your neck, but there we are. Hm. They've taken a second idea into economic. Yeah, that's a fair enough play in that regard. This is definitely something I want to be looking forward to. The intercut area, because that has been changed. So I'm giving you a corners, 25% force limit. So that would be uh, something I want to be like. But if you want any idea group that I've buffed, it, I think the individually person I've buffed the most in this idea group has been the Portuguese. Made them more of a prize for enduring a small Portugal. And hey, they've actually built some forts. This would probably be a good fort as well. I don't think they saw the Aurora fort when these two are such nicer forts. Hills give 10% defense in this. Wait, hills are worse than highlands. That's 20. That's 25. The highland terrain. Hmm. I guess supply limit is nice in highlands, so... Yeah. Honestly, in my brain, both, like, for example, this is forest. Sorry, this is woods. But this is forest. What a fundamental massive difference. <laughs> kind of is marginal, but still, like, yeah. Who really cares? Defensive has been done for Poland, so, uh, for the Portuguese. So they're definitely there already for that kind of war. But as well, the other buffs for the Portuguese, they still have this naval buff if they decide to go for Navy. Uh, they still have the produce global trade power. But now, instead of getting the corners from Land Before Faith, they now get 25% force limit, which is still rather substantial. Have their merchant, they have their artillery command ability and fort defense, which is kind of nice. And their finish now includes the discipline instead of global settlers, so yeah. 
So far, so very nice. Right, well... Oh dear! So when you had to pop a golden... That's concerning. It's incredibly concerning, but there we go. Pop a golden nation to find fight this. And they're over forced them, and they are. They don't know if they're gonna win this. I mean, two times are on a timer, but they're on a generous timer. They can definitely just say screw it, we're bankrupt. I'm not paying back five grand. Yeah, fine. Okay, they don't win the siege here, but the Livonian separatists are about to march in, and that'll give them a free siege progress amount as well. I don't think they're gonna be able to be ready for that fight, although they're going for it at low morale. I'm assuming they want, yeah, they're going to be trying to step in, and they're there. Same time, the Teutons, how much manpower do they even have on the Mercs? Answer is not a lot. The answer really is not a lot. Oh Christ, what has he done? Well, at least England's going for Burgundy. Go England. They're, they realise that all their land is really low, <laughs> low over the year. Uh, autonomous, they might as well. Um, they have no crown land. And England's got exploration. Oh yeah, England knows what's up. Of course they have. Not even surprised. Well done, England. And oh dear god, they got beaten back again. Christ. And there goes that fort right well. That's my uh, slow fall for tabbing back away from that. But there we go. No, Teutons are definitely going to be taking the win here. I mean, they now actually have. A loss ticking. So it is going to be the Teutons who will be. Uh... Getting ticking, and Christ, this is all about to get unseached. Well, they are about to get a bunch of separatists, but not looking great for Lithuania themselves, who are now taking half their loans, so yeah, no, not great at all. Quantity as well as their opener. Well, the Teutons. We'll take seven, and, well, hey, they, their ships are 5% better. <laughs> but there we go. how much ship stuff there is in quality, but there we are. Oh, and also... No rest in peace, Brandenburg. You tried. <laughs> you really did. But, yep, I think that's also going to be potent breaking to peasants. Oh, dear lord. But hey, at least their massive debt is still there. Why is their interest payment so high? Ah, oh, negative stab. But hey, revanchism. Woo. Everyone loves their revanchism for all that land. They did actually lose in fairness, but there we go. Oh, I guess the real winner here has been Georgia. Oh, Christ, that's a general. Well, six fire early on is not great, but at the same... Uh, not, you know, as it may seem, it seem the shock. Make that three, six, five, two. That'll be even more overkill, but there we go. I mean, probably shouldn't be saying that in global chat. Probably shouldn't be saying that you're ready to betray your ally in global chat. So I guess it's a, uh, if you leak that, uh, I'm not ready to betray, you know. In all fairness, I think Florence has been looking at you pretty the entire time. Hey, Florence is Pope. Oh, Florence is Pope. I think they're going to be able to pop. Uh, 
Not sure they'll take. That's normally a nice one. You normally screw your power costs, what people go for. No, they're in a coalition against it. The people could, they, well, they control the probe, they are in a coalition against them. Wait, what does this special relationship actually do? Is there a free subjugation? I doubt it. I mean, you want to be paid for controlling, but there we go. I really, I really do want to test out what this game, what this means. What the hell has he done? I'm concerned. Especially again, Aragon has a bit of reconquest. They have actually lost this reconquest in that point, in, but there we go. Oh, we'll see. Oh, Christ. I hate this. I hate this with a burning passion. Oh, Lord. That's French's uh, entry into that. They're on the concerning side. But I'm sure they'll be. Right, so let's go back to see how our Lithuanian friends are doing. And the answer is, uh, all their rebels are certainly doing a better job of fighting <laughs> the uh, Teutons, but there we go. But yeah, they're going to need new Merc companies. These are all expired. Are they on with Upsilon? I mean, I could... Probably tank that, but I think it'll go well for him. Don't think it'll go well for him at all. No, that is not what we're looking at. Let's take a look at our oh, wood subjects of Castile. No, I, I hate. You have to click on a subject to. Yep, Castile's. Ashland is very good. Good to see. But there we go. Right. Well, Lithuania. Okay, you're coming back in full force. Well, that's fair. The issue is, I don't know how well the Teutons can afford fighting you full force. They had to rehire all their merc companies, which has put a bit of a dent into their existence, unfortunately. But there we go. And there goes the rest of Muscovy. Can't actually take the full thing because they don't board with that, but there we go. Probably should down Yaroslav or something to get through to them, but it is what it is. Oh, it's Defender of Faith, right? Oh, court cool. ally. Okay. Well, at least they have a friend. Also, it's a bit, it should be a bit concerning for Georgia given uh, this kind of friendship going on, but there we are. And hey, Byzantium won that. No, they didn't. Lawrence's land. Oh, Lord. Well, looks like Arak is taking his uh, his stake into the Greeks. I just don't know how happy Sultanate of Rome will be with that. We're not sure how much the Sultanate of Rome can do about that either. Well, we shall see. Right, so it's. Uh, brutal and annoying. <laughs> yes, they've been taking what little slices they can. They themselves are actually trying to have manpower in their companies. But there we go. Did they defend Sudic this? They have actually, so that'd be still a bit more annoying. But a two-stage general goes a long way to that. They don't have any cannons yet. 
Well, the Tech 7 isn't arriving soon. Oh, and the Bonian. He wants to have Tech 7, so that's also another thing why they've been doing quite well this entire time. Surprised they can't pop Golden Age, I guess they don't actually have a large city or developed nation, but there we go. And there we go, right. Well, the day of uh, annexation of Catalonia is coming. Uh, rest in peace, any uh, Catalonian separatists among us, but there we go. Oh no, I, I said the funny thing word. I actually meant it within the context, but there we go. Well, that's. I'm now quite looking forward to see what's going to happen. I'm surprised they haven't gone in. I guess it's more of a Mexican standoff in terms of staring contests at each other. I don't know who wins if no one says that. I mean, Castile has a lot going for them. Portugal also has a bit of potential at the same time. I mean, France is allowed to just sit there and furnace and consolidate England. Yeah, they're going to have to be number one here. You know, basically uncontrolled, uncontested rule over the uh, English Channel. Depends how much they're going to be let in by the Empire, but there we go. Yeah, Burgundy won't exactly be joining the Empire. I mean, hey, Burgundy inheritance will not ha Well, I mean, it will happen, I guess. But, no, it won't happen, actually, because the 204 guy died. Or was it the... No, I don't think so. So, no Burgundy inheritance. Rip. Very surprised Austria is not doing reforms. I mean, there's some nice things here for you to get, but it is what it is, I guess. It is what it is. And oh, Christ! Well, there goes Serbia, and I guess there goes Kosovo. Austria is so. Frank. That's an unfortunate event. But also quality as the first pick is kind of interesting as well. Well, at least I'm happy to see the diversity in first idea group picks. I was worried I couldn't have quality, uh, quality too much, but I'm happy to see that hasn't been the case then. The only people picking it first. I mean, realistically, actually, I do want to see now. The so Portugal into defensive. Defensive one. Quantity one. Two defensive, one quantity. That was a quantity, so two defensive, two quantity. Three defensive, two quantity. Four defensive, two quantity. Two defensive, uh, four quantity, uh, four defensive, two quantity, one quality. Three quantity. Four quantity, four defensive, one quality. Two quality. Okay. That's five for quantity, six for quantity. Six, five so far. Seven, five so Ah, uh, six, six so far. Six six three so far actually. That brings us to the last one. Not the subject. Quantity. So seven quantity, six defensive, three quality openers. Oh and uh, Poland, so eight quantity, six defensive, three quality openers. Oh Burgundy actually. Seven defensive, eight quantity. Yeah. That is seven. Oh, and I guess Naples was a player. I think, did they open one? Yeah. I mean, AI actually got the here because they were dead by that point. So, eight quantity, six defensive, and four quality. That's fair. Actually, all oh, Moscovy still alive to see if what they took. Nothing, and... I don't know if they were alive to take that or if it's just AI, but honestly, I won't even know. I guess, sure. Then, 9 quantity, 6 quality, six defensive, 4. 4 quality. Hmm. 
So while there's a uh, plural plurality for going quantity, it's not a uh, it's not a majority, and it's clearly not a uh, take the throw, you're an idiot. That's a very interesting change. So I guess I still need a bit of a further nerf the quantity, but I don't want to kill it entirely. And I think the quality one may be a bit too. I mean, technically, yeah, there's no went offensive as well, but there we go. I think that's what needs to be tweaked around more than anything. And if we now go to look at our Muscovy, who hasn't picked any. I mean, I can't, I can't do anything about naval, but to make people compete for these four. And I guess Aristocratic as well needs to be a viable opener. So realistically, people will always open a mill idea group in MP. That's just a given. The real question has to be is which one of the, the five across them have to be balanced. And I think a way to maybe balance Aristocratic well, I guess six. If I remove naval ideas and basically give what naval ideas give, so give them to maritime. And then I can make a utility ideas instead of naval ideas. I think that would be kind of an interesting thing to do. But there we go. And hey, Ottomans are growing by taking back their cause from Serbia. That's a bit of a rip for Serbians, but there we go. AI, AI Ottomans got administrative trade. Yay. No. The George is going to have a word to you about that. And rest in peace Byzantium yet again. Oh my god. Lovdiv will be going back, I'm assuming, to Bulgaria. But outside of that, yeah. That will be a run. Well. It's a slow burning Ottomans. How are great powers actually looking? Because I have not checked that in a while. It is France, not surprised, followed by Austria, which I think should be a lot higher up there. I think Austria probably is the strongest tag singly because of the whole empire thing, the amount of gold they have going for them. And everything about that. Then Castile, which is surprisingly that high up, but I guess they actually do have a lot of development. And then England, which really cannot use the development, followed by Kazan, which I'm surprised and higher, but I guess institutions do pain you. Florence is fair to see up there, and so is Lithuania, but then, yes, yeah, Sweden coming into 8. And to say the least, yeah, absolutely all players, no questions asked there. Yeah, I don't. Germany now remains the only few rare. As Poland getting knocked out is ironic, but there we go. And I'm assuming, did they break to... Yeah, they broke to peasants. So, Christ, that's very autonomous land, rather, to believe again. Oh, well. Could be worse. Right, it is 1486, so we are approaching the day of Catalonian annexation, and that will be the real question of how strong Castile is in terms of fighting a Portugal in a 1v1, but I'm assuming that the French do come down. And the French now, this day, are so dead. Florence, France, Portugal. But given that France and France talking about a 1v1 earlier, that's. I don't know how likely that is to happen. But there we go. In the June of, this, in the, June of the next year, that will be that annexation complete. Ten more months, really. No, eleven, sorry. Yeah, but there we go. At least they're starting to really recover, actually, yeah. Hmm. The magical mine has been improved. The thing is, as well, is they need to... What I found, as well, is building a fort in Leon if you're ever fighting the, po the Portuguese. It's probably an idea. It's a very nice fort to have, Leon. And it's a surprising mountain in the middle of nowhere, which is an excellent turn. Uh, Excellent defensive province. Malaga is obviously you keep that, and I'd like to put a fort on Granada. I basically like to put a fort on this entire state of Apera to lose the eventually, but that's normally because this is a problem. <laughs> it kind of isn't now, so there we go. And eventually, of course, you have some excellent Navarra. You did lose to the French, but you will have this fort still. You still have Burger, and you can stick a fort in Rioja. You can set a fort in Urgell. It's honestly fine, and you. Oscar does cut off this boss at least. And Rosella can be fought. Yeah, I mean, that would be nice, but. Yeah. I mean, if they can grab Tenerife here, then that would be everything for them. It would really turn the tides on the Portuguese, because without Tenerife, the Portuguese really don't have a lot going for them. 
without that, an excellent force that had entirely carried by, well, this quote-unquote New World Empire. And 13 force limit out of this is kind of brutal. Basically 100 development worth of force limit, which is not to be a scourge, especially since that's base multiplied by 25% um, from Tenerife itself. So defensive here is probably an idea to really squeeze out a bit of quality while you can, especially since you're going to struggle paying for uh, 39k here. I'm assuming second they will go economic, but always willing to see any changes. Oh, and Lithuanian Teutons are still out of Christ. I mean, no, yeah, Teutons are... I mean, I did say earlier Lithuanian is going to overcommit to this, so... Oh, Christ, they are. Oh, Christ. That's not a good idea. I think you've been overcommitted to that now, I'm being honest. But there we go, right. I mean, they can slip through here and be annoying, and you have to split up your armies, which is never a good idea. And if you're going over here with that, you're just asking them to march over and kill that stack. That's the thing, they can always hide in Oslo and not get wiped. Nice. Well, manpower recovery is super nice for you, but there we go. I don't think they're going to be living long enough to get their 10% uh, infantry combat ability, but... There we go. Hey, church power. Woo. Yeah, actually, no more military stuff. They get all their military stuff early, but... <laughs> Finishing quality will be nice. And there we go, economic. Especially for the discipline increase. If anything, and wow, they have gone out all in. Tradition, they got the... And they got the event. Nice. Christ, their rulers really be a lot better now. Okay. But they're going to be taking that home. I mean, Lithuania, you're going to be hurting for this. Take a loan every four months, and that's not pretty. It's not pretty at all. Unlike whatever happening is here, it's also very much not pretty. These. Yeah. No. Is Yaroslav a subject? They did just take this. That's fair. Hiding on a. Forming Russia, then? I mean, they really should, I don't think. But. I have to see how that goes to them. They're starting to walk through defensive as well, so that's always a good sign to see. This will be quite nice to pick up because. Actually, paying. Uh, not that much on forts, but that'll be a nice discount anyway. And hey, they have got themselves most of Oh, Sweden going in against Lithuania. Well, that's. Border will. What CB is that? Well, I wouldn't know, but Lithuania, that's. Uh... I mean, Sweden, you could easily smash if you decide to uh, keep your army around, but. There we go. <laughs> well, Lithuania definitely went from one of the strongest tanks in the game to. Uh... Not doing too well, I guess the Teutons really, uh, really were quite painful for them, but there we go. And there we go, Castle has integrated this land. They have fully statified it, and I'm going to be assuming they're going to be decreasing the autonomy. They already have, Lord. It's a lot of autonomy. But hey, that crown land exists. And they actually have something resembling an army. 44 force limit now is very nice, and an actual economy to boot as well. Probably the only thing I can rival the French now. Yep. Not well, of course, but still not going to be trivial to fight either. They should probably also start playing for these forts sooner rather than later. They also pick themselves up four galleys, which is not a trivial amount to pick up, so nice of them to do that. Hey! An actual economy exists now, and they're actually running decent advice. Got a half price added one, which is also quite good. And their uh, rulers aren't as bad as they used to be. Right, so how are the Lithuanians going to be handling this? Uh, well, they're going to be taking another battle with Teutons instead. Okay. How was that going to go for them? Well, I mean, Lithuania definitely has a morale advantage there, I'll tell you that much. And that is a zero for the Teutons, so that's not looking pretty. 
And I'll also go late for that nine. And there goes that attempt out of a breakthrough. Unfortunate. But okay, they're on the Teuton cap now. And it's 40 war scores, so they can enforce. They can't enforce one PC yet, actually. And there we are. Oh dear. I will be honest, I think this is entirely Mercs, isn't it? Yes, it is. They're actually going to be bankrupt soon. We want to keep this up. A lot sooner than the uh, Teutons will be. Oh, yeah, Teutons have more money and are losing less. I think they're actually they're going to go bankrupt. Well, they can get the white piece. I'll tell them that much. They can get the white piece now and 24 war score worth of land. But, ouch. That is not pretty, and then the fact they're losing that much money. Meanwhile, the Swedish have slowly arrived into the battle. And there we go. Yeah, you can tell it's a very old mission tree, because it's the base mission tree, plus a, a couple extra ones, which used to be nice, but... Yeah, nothing compared to the power creep of modern mission trees. Or basically any app in our mission tree. Subject country, yeah, Swedish New World doesn't really uh, work quite well for you. Oh, Christ, okay. Going to civil wars. Oh, Lord. Have mercy on the English soul. Because the French certainly won't. Right. Topic of mercy. That's ten months I was doing it. You need to get a plan. I need to get a plan that's... Going to be better than just, ooh, I'm gonna win this and I'll be fine. Ooh, I'm gonna win this. Ooh. Um, don't know how well that'll go for you, but best of luck in that. Anyway. Um, hmm. Yeah, Lithuania definitely was a lot scarier last session. But Kazan's taking their bite, and so is, uh. As well as Kazan taking their bite, if you know honest, but there we go. And I guess Karaman getting their bite over Constantinople. But relatively low dev, but I think it's all the consolidation of it. I mean, Poland has a full core on this thing, for crying out loud. Poor Haiga Sophia has been fully destroyed. But there we go. I'm interested to see if the French will ever... Uh... Oh, well, there we go. That was... Is that a one you one Speak on the It might be. Interesting army composition. Interesting army composition indeed, but they are at full summit, they're actually making money, and they probably will want to go over it. Quantity though is the other nice thing to have. Spine of it is also coming up. They're up on head on tech as well. Seven on seven, a bit behind on dip, but honestly, who cares? Okay, and there's, there go the loans. I think in burger loans, but I guess private trading fleets is their priority. And there is the French army, right. Marching into the sky, but at the same time... Okay, they are playing for these fields now, so, so far so good. Surprised the Portuguese have not been called in, because they probably, I mean... I'm really surprised they haven't. Because they're one and a shot, really. So I was thinking they might be doing separate wars, though. But we shall see. And the Portuguese are a non trivial uh, threat now. And Florence is also really much not involved. Actually, they're fighting the Austrians. Okay, well, everything's sticking up here. Christ. And France is the Austrian. Ooh, that is going to be a problem because that is going to be France in that. Oh, it is punitive war, which is kind of actually on the greatest CB. You can't really take a land. You can basically just release everyone under the sun. Anyway, at least it doesn't cost you money points, but Christ, if you win this, you can release half of 
half of the country. Can't say I've been subject to be a bit brutal as well. Yeah, that's actually relatively brutal. Spread their country a bit. Yeah. Not pretty at all. Return some courts to Byzantium. <laughs> Might be a good idea actually to knock them out of Greece. But I don't know if the. Um, you have to enforce that, I mean. What do they have in terms of troops? 60k, what do the. Uh, they have in terms of troops? 47. Oh, they better start using the troops because. Okay, in come the Venetians. Oh, I Venice no less, but there we go. He's Darigons there, and there we go. Okay, they're going to be winning that battle. But Austria probably should consolidate back everything. I think they were waiting for this kind of Dow, but for France to be distracted. There we go. Ah, Portugal building up to fourth limit, so that can only tell you one thing. It's about to start being fun. No mountains, and maintenance modifier is also about to hit. And oh dear, that is not looking pretty for your Castile. But let me guess, is that because France has figured out? Yep, Elan, and more than so, full defensive is going to be brutal with five morale. Yeah, that's uh, it's going to be pretty for five morale. Compare that to four point three here, and okay, there goes that also button. And there go the loans. Generous loan taken off the bat immediately, but there we go. Hmm. But if that'll be enough, they're gonna have to spend time to recover this. And again, they haven't built the Leon Fort, which would normally go for a long while for them. <laughs> they haven't upgraded the haven't got that governing cap or the treasure fleet income. What a shame. Right. Well anyway, how's the Slovenia doing? Well Double check on our Lithuanian friends. They haven't taken corruption, but Looking pretty on that. The Teutons, meanwhile, 100% of the year, but okay. Well, I guess the Teutons are reduced to Prussia. Very interesting piece still, because this actually ironically does still allow them to form Prussia. And they don't leave the empire because I believe they're electors, right? No, they just don't leave the empire. Interesting. Just need an. Oh no! Look at all this imperial land. Well, there goes the country. Yeah. Oh, there we go. Right. Assuming the French will be uh, fully focused on this. That is actually their entire army in fairness. But, it seems that can still be able to probably just throw enough money at this. They're going to have to probably go to debt themselves. I don't think the Austrians are going to let them off clean either. Well, it depends, I guess, who they're really coming after. Florence here in France. They are able to call in the Portuguese, but... I'm surprised about the Portuguese do not want to be involved yet, which... I don't know why it's about as good as I think yet. Okay, in they march. Really could have better generals, no offense there. 2 2 is not great. It's giving a full shock advantage to the French. Ooh, and no fire advantage. But 2 6 is brutal because shock is still basically the way to go the early on. But there we go. Well, the slaughter's a slaughter. The only thing from it is I think. In we might still see a Castilian win here, simply due to the numbers of all. And that we do. With, with the French then packing. Probably that's the thing that Portugal has to bear in mind, is that if they do back the wrong course here, France gets them packing. They're two forts away from being occupied, and then they can start enforcing for things like Tenerife. And once they enforce Tenerife, oh, they're gone. They should only join this if they're confident France is winning. And then they have to bear in mind that, okay, sure, we might grow, etc. But how do I make sure that France doesn't turn around on me and then eat me? Because this is basically glorified divide and conquer here. Now, normally Portugal and Castilla can make an alliance because Portugal has spaces to expand to, but this is the only place for Portugal to go. So. It is what it is. But there we go. Right. So, are the Lithuanians going to choose to fight this? It seems the answer is yes. And they're going to be losing less money, so. 
Now more of a 20 months until bankruptcy, but... Now the Swedes have been beaten back, though. Yeah, the Swedes are going to have to take this war seriously, I'm afraid. Hey, they picked up their 5% uh, discipline now, and once they do this, they pick up another 5%, which is non-trivial, especially the infantry ability this early on. So there we go. <laughs> yeah. Pretty common ability, of course, this early is also magic, but, you know, we can dream. We can dream indeed. Right. So, yeah, Florence, I'll be honest with you. They also, Austria also has the junior partners. So. And it's not going to be pretty, and I don't, I don't think the French are going to be here enough to save you. No war score from battles, yes, yeah, seven from that one. And the two to one, even if it is AI, it's still brutal. What morale are we looking at? Five point oh Christ, yeah, they popped a gold, they popped a golden age, yeah. No surprise there. They popped aggressive expansion, transfer subjects, and bonus and capital. That's fair. Let's swap the dev cost. Or the war taxes. Maybe the war taxes are the idea to go here, but we shall see. Still making money, which I'm so okay, not anymore. There we go. There go their mercs, and there go them being over four, so no. Decent generals, though. 4-4 four, four in a combat. Eventually, if they have both of those fighting, which they probably will be. Hmm. Not pretty. And the French aren't exactly... Shall we say committing. I mean, they're making money. Great. But they're under force limit. Yeah. Not the best position to be in. They still have that. But they have picked the dev cost up. Instead of transfer subjects to war taxes, which is interesting. I shall think how the Portuguese have the Portuguese picked up double war tax. No, they have just picked up adaptive combat terrain. That's fair. They have both these at least. But there's the French army sent packing and oh, that's the siege of Navarra. Reconstruction of the fort as well. Yeah, that's uh. Unfortunate. Okay, the Castilians do have... Oh, yeah, cannons. So they may have actually... I may have missed that, but I'm guessing they may have... Since just capital fought past the wars and assaulted here. And they got that very early win. That may not end X well for the French. I mean, still definitely knows what they want to do. And that is, uh, I want an assurance this isn't going to happen again. And that kind of expansion here. And as that, also another thing I want to do is for you to break with Portugal. Once you break with Portugal, I probably have another thing to say to the Portuguese. But there we are. I mean, if Castile gets their hands on a Tenerife, that will be brutal for them. Definitely going to be able to use this incredibly well. <laughs> Especially on their gold mine, actually. 20% of this producer is going to be a decent chunk of mine. Anyway, how's the Slovenia going? Well, still approaching bankruptcy. But at least they're not taking corruption yet. Also, they're about to fail, to fail in a state agenda. Let me just pay off their debt. No, building a marketplace. Okay, I mean, you can see why now it's a problem, but I don't know if you should be failing that. But hey, at least they're making the offensive. And... Well, that money forced them into, uh, forced them into bankruptcy. But there we go. Oh, it is what it is. Just break what your alliance with uh, Georgia. <laughs> oh, well, there we go. Yeah, I doubt they're going to take that play. Oh, that is. I think I know how that's going to go. Oh, wow. What a surprising guess. I think it's going to be the partition of Georgia here. But if they accept this, then this might be what keeps Georgia alive. Now, Georgia does have this excellent general over here, and it's an excellent amount of forts, so the Horde is really going to struggle here as well. It's probably one of a few cold provinces as well, <laughs> but there we go. Not that we'll get this far realistically, but, you know, a man can dream. Anyway, the mountains persist. 
to persist, they shan't. Christ, that's everyone at war. Warrants now, oof. Oof. Their capital is under a siege there. I don't think that state is going to be finished, I'm afraid. Austria leading the charge. Lithuania trading was the Swedish, but bankrupt in 10 months. And Caraman dishonoring the court to arms with Georgia. Well, okay, Caraman cannot be trusted, but again, you can. Ypsilon and Tayeta are getting, well, looks like he's getting a round on his death warrant in Castile, but there we go. And that's ah, surprising use of boats against the French Navy it really does not exist. Oh, it really, really does not exist, actually. Wait, they pop this as well. Are they building them? Oh, they are actually building their cannons. Okay. They're free. Wow, Castile actually going on the offensive here. Interesting. They are going to be... Probably wanted to hire some mercs or at least build some troops. They have a decent... Oh my lord, that's... Without quantity as well. That's impressive. To get... And they have popped increased levies. How much are the crown out against the nobles? Oh, a decent chunk. Okay. Not a trivial amount then. And into the battle they go. I say this from the Castilian perspective as they will be down on morale and defending. And my money's still on the French here. They have almost everything going for them, but apart from numbers, okay, basically, but the quality of this fight, I think it's good. Yeah, that's... You're not going to get reinforced at the time. And they get in there, but I think they're actually going to win that. Yeah, okay. The French will need to get themselves, well, their army ready. And there they go back up to the board. The siege reset, unfortunately, but there we go. Hey, there are two cannons are there. Not four cannons, I believe, yep. The French also need to get... Okay, they actually do have some cannons. Ah, the French army was over here. Helping the warrants drive them back, which is fair. Save an ally. Bring an ally. The other side of the coin is, of course, is, is Florence in this war, and the answer is no. But I guess if you want to burn your own land and let the Castilians advance slowly but surely while making sure Florence wins this. Oh, they're only respecting your lives, at least. Oh, Christ, that's going to just go bankrupt. No, you took a stab it. But there's your peace deal, and oh no. I think it bankrupt him. Yep. Oh! You're not going to spend your mana points? No, you're not. And oh dear, of course, you didn't get to call this. That's your cause in Riga. Unfortunate, Christ. Well, I guess I would have held on until I finished my course, but that's just me. I don't know if they had that option. Maybe taking the odd card. Okay. Well, all this has done is it hasn't really weakened Georgia, but it has really shown the Georgia that Caraman cannot be trusted. The other thing is, of course, is that, well, the expansion of is incredibly limited, so it might be time for them to bunker down Dev and sit in Georgia. Although Deving Mountains, well, uh, you know, Beth is dry. Not too bad, but mountains are notoriously not fun to dev. 35% increase. But hey, they have at least something resembling. But there we go. Florence and Austria are still at it, and so is Castilla and France. All of these have now pieced out, and I can kind of see why the Portuguese don't want to be involved. The Castilians are very much able to just turn around and stop them here. Of course, the occupation of this war. Kind of a big deal because now they need to go through the mountain here to attack. Well, that is not going to be pretty. They have not called the Portuguese in as well, which would probably serve as a distraction, but it'll probably enter the death of the Portuguese, if anything, because they're definitely going to be beaten up and in one piece they'll take Tenerife and you're done. Portugal's dead. That's the only thing keeping them alive. 
But hey, they can take that in quantity, which actually isn't probably a bad idea. Extreme strength isn't something you expect they want, sure, but... Oh, okay, they have actually sorted that out. Now going to be starting to approach that 25% force limit, which, given how much they're over force limit, it's probably something they want to get their hands on. And they are going to be able to get uh, this as well if they go through more economic ideas. I mean, most of the way towards their diplomatic reputation as well. Not sure how much that will get for them. Right, so let's look at the Florence front and uh, the coalition war in general. The answer is. Three war score. Yeah, not pretty, but. Mm, Austria taking the offensive back again. Florence is well out of our power, starting to lose a significant amount of money. Very much over four summits, so. Not the prettiest sight as well for them, and I think the French are going to be involved here. The French also not only really taking an offensive here, they know they can't really be in both places at once. At least that's hampering their expansion into whatever the hell's going on with England at this point, but there we are. And with that, I think, yep, yeah, that is the Ottomans getting killed by Caravan. A fascinating backstab as well. This kind of leaves Georgia with no one. Guess they can get Lithuania, but that's still more of a uh, dying country now. Still not a relevant one. If they can ally the Austrians, though, they can have something going against an eventual Caravan. The Austrians certainly have bigger fish to fry at the moment, and Pazan and Caravan are very much aligned in that regard. Lithuania's currently bankrupt as well, so not exactly sure how much help there will be. I'm about to enter a civil war, so that won't be pretty either. People can actually intervene on the side of the Austrians in the uh, Polish, but I doubt anyone will. Aha, and the Portuguese have gone in, and I missed that, and they're getting slaughtered. Okay. <laughs> well, um, gives France their opportunity to go for it, but... And, wow, that's a... Uh, that's the general, Ulster, I guess. You're willing to do your part. Garbury McCarthy. Actually, an excellent general. 4543 as well. Christ. What's that beast deal? Uh, I don't think they want to do that. They better wipe that before the general links up with the French. <laughs> oh, but there's that Castilian. Well, talk about bad generals, and I think they got their uh, they uh, four 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 three is an excellent choice at this point. They've certainly won in that, and wow, okay, straight away breaching walls and are older than eleven, so that's a uh, not a pretty sight to behold. Is the entire city of Portugal now reduced to nothing though? Well, they're hiring mercs in desperation, but. Hey, they can take the Advent Tech. Ooh. I'm assuming Castile has the Miltech 8. No, they don't, but France does, so that would be interesting. And they might have been just about to win Burgos here again. Get to the Leon Fault. Right, okay. Oh, it is what it is. And here comes the rest of the French. Meanwhile, yeah, Florence is not going to be looking too hot at the end of that. Well, there we are. Fortunately, a bit of a backstab, but I guess France realized, okay, let me focus on Castile, we'll be done with this, then I can save you, as it were. Ah, yeah. Well, there goes the uh, entire uh, mercenary stacks of Portugal. I think I'll be able to cop a siege of the student rather than later, though, unfortunately for them. It's Lisboa Fort, I think. If it is, then Coimbras might be the only problems they actually don't have access to. Let's check. So they have access to here, access to here, access to here, through Porto. And yet they don't have access to Coimbras. The rest they can look into. So, not the prettiest site, not the prettiest site for war. And already burning through most of your manpower. I guess, yeah, they want to get their Miltech here, which is fair. Cavalry shock and infantry fire coming up. Quite important. There's another Merc stack. Right. At least they're making money. They have 1k men in uh, Gran Canaria, but 
apart from securing yourself, but uh, trading sugar uh, for that war sweet, sweet war score reduction, literally, that really doesn't do much for you, I'm afraid. It's about the only colonial province that Castile holds in, a in the random islands of the coast, sense. but there we are. A little start off or something. No, that's just the classics. And poor little Platinate having... Ah, uh, yeah. So it's not Platinate's day, is it? It's not Platinate's day indeed. Mm. By 1491, I really thought they would have done, gone a lot further. But I guess uh, you can get quite unlucky sometimes. Right. Well, they can take the next turn, I uh, again, see if they take that opportunity to go colonize or something. But no, okay, they're going to be killing Novgorod instead. Fair enough. And at least they take an institution. Yes, about everyone institution now. And Kazan also great power number three with that. Hmm. Oh, but there goes the fort. And with that fort gone, that means, yep, the French can link up and contest in the mainland. Yep. And there the French arrive, passionately destroying that 1k stack. Yeah, I don't know if you want to go into that battle, but. I really don't know if you do. But Christ cast you, that's uh, passionate. I'm not going to give up without a fight, which is fair to do at this point, I guess. But yeah. At least cast France going to be paying for this land. Now you're in France, you just you don't have super soldiers. That mean they're great, but they're not going to be able to win one v fives. This kind of annoys me that they are going to be feeding wins and wins to Castile here. I'm sure this looks impressive. And actually, they're about to, oh my god, they did as well. That's it's going to matter because eventually, once Navarre gets this fort done by 42, that's going to be incredibly painful for anyone to really do with a level three fort. It's no joke. Hey, Portugal has landed to relieve Lisboa. Ooh. Uh, yeah, they're going to get slaughtered. Um, but yeah, with the French being beaten back, that's going to be spelling the end of the Portuguese here, unfortunately, especially since it's a separate war. How much is this going to cost them? At 66, that would be a lot of war scores along short of it. So 33. That's at around 34 as well, so that's 17. That's going to be 57 war score. Yeah, once they get some sieges going, it's best not going to be hard to acquire. And stay. Well, they seem to deprive Portuguese ownership of Tenerife, and that's it. Oh, and there go the rest of the Castilian loans. <laughs> Let me guess. But yeah. Okay, the French have got a Merc stack. Oh, I see the going here. Christ. And they, there they go immediately on that. Miltech 8 is taken. Miltech 9 is the next big thing. And with Tech 9, you can really do a lot of work if you have Tech 9 and he doesn't. So that would be interesting to see. And they're going to go into that battle with their glorious 4443. French, meanwhile, are now the people down with less generals. But at the end of the day, it's actually only a 2 fire uh, advantage. And the French will not pull morale there, and there we go, there is the Castilian morale. Golden Age, Golden Age, yep. No surprise there, they have not taken adaptive combat terrain, which is interesting, but with that morale bonus gone, that's... What do you think for the French here? They can really get just about to get slaughtered, actually, in the given the numbers. I think that's going to be about to be wiped if they pursue further, and then... Okay, they're going to walk that in, interesting choice. I would have gone for this first, but then again, I'm not in the country. And okay, we're going to stack everything. Okay, no, no, no proper reinforcement. Nope, we're going to need to stack that 11k in immediately. Okay. Sure, maybe like Stanley out as well immediately? No? Okay. 
we're gonna lose this is actually over for them in 20 months right that's uh that's the way to burn a country but there you go i mean they they know that if they don't burn here they're dead so yeah and remarkably Florence has actually beaten the austrian back in the game it's kind of impressive you can take one of Can they, uh, can they meme? Actually, can as well, Christ. Okay, that's the problem consolidating your account on the gold mine. You consolidate development, but then it ends up being not that taxed. Never pretty, but there we go. Oh. At least the Florence aren't getting a free rain out of this, anyway. And okay, that's the thing, with the French being beaten back, they're now relatively free to turn around and basically slaughter what remains of the Portuguese. Again, yeah, that's why the Portuguese maneuver there, I guess, is a very high risk. They're forced into it, but uh, it's the end of the game there if they lose. Wait, they have still have cores? Christ. No, they actually still do. Remarkable. 1630 says a recent core. And hey, they have a uh, caraman. Woo. Very company, but there we go. It's a fun fact about Georgia, actually, they can trade completely the entire. Well, it looks like the Georgians are the ones, not the Armenians, in the culture conversion. Oh, I guess, yeah, culture conversion pointing instead of accepting it. Probably a bit cheaper. Uh, so, that's actually fair. Assuming they've accepted the Turks. Yes, they have, which is probably a fair thing to do, given their uh, only real ambitious pack plans are will be into mainland Turkey. If they can carve themselves into a nice border here, and then basically hold the mountains, they can't sit here for basically forever and require a million casualties to get through. And well, there we go. Right. Well, the Austrians have turned up. Hmm, not the smartest idea, Austria, be honest with you. No, not the smartest idea at all. No, that might even be wiped. I think that's going to be wiped. No, it wasn't. They get there in time. But this is going to lose that. Don't assault. Just in general, that idea. They might actually end up winning that, though. Yeah, there's enough of them to push through. I think that arrives first. That's enough for them to win. Not with a one roll, of course, but they're going to need to roll better than that. And that's the zero is not better than that. Roll better. Come on. Okay, but there we go. There's that nine against the zero. And. Ooh, is that locked in? That's now just locked in. Oh, oh dear, okay. Well, they're quite low morale, so they might have something here, but it's going to cost them. They actually have cannons, and that's a 0 against a 9, though, but there's a repeat 8 against a 1, and you can look how quickly they melt in that top phase. Yeah, not pretty at all. Well, that's not a no retreat, so this won't be a wipe, at least. But there goes Paris. Giving Castile that machine to break to focus on resieging these provinces, and finally put... The Portuguese are out of their misery. Are the Portuguese trying to plan a... Uh, I don't know if the Portuguese noticed this, but they can actually build every Merc stack under the sun. If they really wanted to... Uh, here, they're free to do that, because that's still blocked by forts, but I guess they don't know that. And there it is, the free company, their only real troops. Although they have a bit of an army on the islands here. If anything, I guess the argument is they can be reduced to the islands, but there we go. Well, at least they got their goods produced. I was actually I was actually really hoping to see a Portugal that in view as well, because twenty five percent force limit and five percent discipline with additional military combat ability they have anyway is actually gonna be a very interesting tag and a quite a powerful one at that, especially with Tenerife, but honestly not looking great for that dream right now. Hmm. Especially with the Austrians. Picking a very good time to bully the French. I think they've realised that, sure, they can get back to Florence, but they can get out of Florence eventually. They need to play the French to submission here, at least hurt them. And the Cast Castile is going to be on the offensive here again. They kind of have to be, given they are very much on a timer. Although, they actually have quite a few more loans still to take. By quite a few, I mean like two or three more. And oh no, Hungary has... I'm assuming a random Florence ally has taken that. Yeah. But Venice is starting to fall. But yeah, not looking great for the French. That is a set. I 
Ah, uh, yeah. No, I don't know how much they care about that. And so that's a very interesting uh, declaration. They really think they're going to be able to get over there? I don't know, but I hope they're not nation really. Because that would be bad, donation rockets. Mm. Oh well, it is what it is. I really have no idea what George's plan here is, I'll be honest with you. I guess they... Oh no, are they doing what I think they're doing? Because they could walk over here and use that as a way to fight the Caribbeans. <laughs> in this case, this actual fort makes sense because it prevents memes like that. Watch me, Castile. Yeah, you've got 10 months. Or you need to start taking max corruption again. Not the prettiest position to be in. And then the French are by the border. Well, it's any consolation, at least you made this whole thing Catholic. Ooh. <laughs> That's another thing, information is coming up soon. We need to see if uh, Austria will go for it or uh, keep the Emperor's ship. I'm assuming Milan certainly will, and a lot of the others will here. Yeah. Only at, mostly at Bowen and Friesland. And I'm assuming what's left of the. Wow, they've been reduced to their starting position. Christ. Rough, so maybe uh maybe I'll re them into Bavaria. I think that would be the uh the play. England of course take an exploration as they always will. Oh but France have a glorious general of their own. Ouch. And now that stacks through. Ooh, that's not pretty. I mean, Austria was looking at that battle, but they started against it, which is probably fair. Well, if anything, that helps the, them with whole being over forced to make bankruptcy buttons, but there we go. I don't any consolation in Portugal, though. It will not be long for this world. Oh. Oh, very bad. Oh, that wasn't a three star. That is the uh, Ulster General carrying the entire time. <laughs> the French have a 4 4? The wrong generals. Oh, Christ. England, Scotland declared on England inciting the defense. Someone actually re a Scotland. You know what? Yeah, I might re a the Scotland there. Yeah. And this rate. Where did Scotland go? Administrative! Woo, go Scotland! That might actually have a viable Scotland recent if they win their independence and actually take a decent chunk of England here. I mean, obviously, the French will come knocking, but the French want to see their own problems, and I think a fight on the mainland is something they'll be looking at. Imagine, in all fairness, they clean up the Austrians pretty well here, and there are the Portuguese trying to relieve themselves of that siege. I don't know how well that will go for them, but that's certainly an attempt. I think they're loose here. Yes, they do, but they stopped the siege, and that means that. But Castile's eyes probably been brought to that now, yeah. Fortunately, yeah, they will now realize that Castile can't go into that task and start recruiting on. I don't know if that will be exactly enough for them. But there we go. I so he's been left relatively alone. He's had time to go through their ideas. Sweden. No, you haven't. But you have finished quality though, so. That's nice for you. Friedland, you've been going through ideas, right? Yep, full quantity econ. So there's the dev cost. That initial quantity gamble has paid off, so they're able to start deving. And 
Well, I was gonna say how their army doing, but I guess they're, they're busy fighting a couple of people. But there we go. I've also been feeding Brunswick and Hassan to annex them down by 97. Yep, fair. I mean, I'm believing Bremen is a free city. No, yeah, it is free city and trade leaks. So that is just annoying to deal with. Yeah, you come back. Castile is in a lot of uh, fun. I'm not sure what the hell Georgian humiliation of Venice was about, but there we go. There, Castile has 10 months before bankruptcy, although I think they're going to be able to piece out the Portuguese soon. Oh, they doubt them. The poor ah, they were anxious to wait. They themselves doubt because well, we're at war with them anyway. That's fair, actually. Brave but fair. And they might have a thing here because they, if at a certain point they can get enough war score, they can enforce and just take Tenerife, and that knocks Portugal out and gives Castile the counterplay they kind of need desperately. Twenty-five force limit is going to go a long way to that. Uh, tell you that much. It's not exactly uh, another 45, that's another 20, but it's another 10 force limit, basically. That's another 10 point. Once they finish quantity as well with this, they're going to be brutal. And once they form Spain, that's going to go up from 25 to 33 as well. Christ, I'm getting a break to siege of these lands for free, are they? Portugal's a 45, yeah, with the fall of Lisbon coming up sooner rather than later. That's not going to be pretty, but yeah. France has got carried a bit actually earlier. They got a, their ally, their subjects in Ulster got an excellent three star general. But yeah, that 4543, but yeah, okay. It's a 99. They got what they want. Uh, one moment. Yep. You can 98% him, I just can't talk to him because I'm black. Hello. Uh, yeah, Forced I can... Enforce. Forced to so enforce. So I can 98 him. Yep. Which, I, get, I send him a 98. Hello. Uh, yeah, Forced to enforce. Austin so I can force. 98 of them. Yeah. But I, I send them a 98. Hello. Uh, yeah, I can... Austin and Austin. Yeah. So I can... 98. Oh, I can hear myself. I I twice. Right. But there we go. Where is Portugal? Can cookie... Yeah, he is enforced in a 98 Portugal, I'm afraid. Uh, he tried to take a province up here, not to each. Uh, yeah. yeah, but there's no fort there. So you can. So the, that's the why rule they prohibits forts. Yeah, but the rule declines forts. There is no fort there, so you can't take that. I don't know. What the fuck? Really? No, that's stupid, because it says AI. AI won't do that, even if it doesn't AI have a fort. AI actually would do that, because there's no fort there. Wait, yeah, remember, no. there was the old trick where you take the Caribbean, and you can take yeah. the entire Caribbean without occupying anything in the Caribbean against if you're fighting Portugal, there's no forts there. If you build a fort in Tenerife, you couldn't. He, he rejected. Uh, yeah, he, he's trying to say take a province that is not occupied. He can, again, because you don't have a fort there. Yeah, so That's not take... in, in rules, I'm afraid. I can see you arguing, I'm afraid, but yeah. I sent it to him, so... Gotta peace out, right? I mean, I'll pull the moment, but... He, he can't take that, I'm afraid. Yeah, if you build a fort there, he couldn't. <laughs> yeah, well, he can't build one now, so... No, Too not late. This. Yeah. Love of God. Mm. Right. Portugal. 
It's yeah, force peace, I'm afraid. Yeah, I force peace. That's good. Oh, he did reject to send it again. When you go diplomat. Okay, well, I sent it again. Okay. Also, Castile, why the fuck does Austria declare a coalition war? I sent it to him. But, yeah. Anyway, again, if you build a fort there, then yes, but AI will accept the speech that I can demonstrate. Yeah, I'm at 98. How does the AI have anything to do with it? Uh, well, because I... if you check the rules, it's you can't take unoccupied fort provinces. Not just random islands, because otherwise people would never be able to take random islands. Yeah, but then you can take GV. Time, but like yeah, you can take I'm surprised you didn't build a fort on it, honestly. Uh, how so... does it Always it's we not find the one rule that making. <laughs> Problems. Gonna... I don't know, but like again, if I mean, people can be mad here, either I rule in favor of Castile or rule in favor of Portugal. I'm not gonna pick that's that's how how it, but that's how not, I, I won that's against Portugal. That's how it's going. Portugal, another lobbyist that you can't take provinces that. But you have, you are it, not it doesn't occupied. make any sense that you should be allowed to take a province that is not occupied. But I I I occupied. I inherited the, I didn't this rule, <laughs> these rule set. I mean, we can yeah, make a petition to change them for next one. This is the first time people have ever bought to take an island because we've made it. Matter now, but this is like yep. right. time to well, change it next time. I've done like 15 games, so this has literally never mattered. But I'm taking on it, it does have a matter at the end. This is a rule. I'm surprised you didn't build a fort on it again. And this yeah. is why well, we should people have a fort. I have, I have total control of the navy. I don't need I have, a fort there, and I have, I have total control. control over your country. If you didn't know, yeah, that. again, by no. rules, it's oh, I think it's pretty dumb, but just I peace out. So stupid. It's Literally rule, read the rules. <laughs> yeah, well, rule says that you have to do it then. Like, yeah, just leave. I can before see that this matters. I can see that this matters in literally this only case. However, like, I'm surprised you didn't build a fort there. I thought yeah. you built a fort because you can't take provinces you don't control a fort over. But yeah, just do the British deal. So we can continue. Let's go. Come on, Portugal. <laughs> that is so. So yeah, it is dumb, but just fucking do the best. It is, yeah. you lost. It is the rule. Like, that works. That's ridiculous. That's rule. fair. I can change next time, okay, but you have to occupy an island if it's going to be that specific. Yeah, but... it's occupy. It's an you island. Need to occupy no? province. If yeah, you I think it should probably I think occupy just be province. province. Okay, but at the yeah, same I time, I... if I change rules mid-session, that's yeah, also a bit no, unfair on fair the player. Enough. I hope you understand. Yeah. So I'm afraid. Also, as much as I love I... the drama, please take the peace too. I just wouldn't peace out with you then. I just, yeah, you just yeah. wait till you go bankrupt and send my navy out. Yeah, that's something you can do indeed. I'll just right. do that. Well, okay, Portugal, well, are you taking the pieces okay. or not? Oh, yes, everyone no. is in this room. What the fuck? <laughs> I need to change no, again. Okay, can get a person to get a look in. Bruh. Accept the piece too. Portugal. So, I'm not gonna unpause because that's gonna hurt Castile. So, Portugal, take your piece too. That's so stupid. <laughs> I mean, it's you're dead current anyway. rules, and if I it's it's the current rules, and I can't change the rules mid-session because that's a bit you know unfair as well to say the absolute minimum. Under current rules, you can't do that. Bro, right. oh. bruh, this fucking Savoy is such an idiot. You can just get out of this war. Hello. Are you, are you are you just going to sit here looking pretty? Please just take the piece. Fucking Savoy is such an idiot. Take the PS2 so we can continue. Hello. Are you just going to Let's, fu let's fucking rehost. Like... This is fucking stupid. <laughs> yeah, like, right. accept it. It's... Okay, I'm done. It was stupid rules. It is stupid right. rule, but it's It is rule. stupid rule, but if I change the rule mid session, that's also unfair. Welcome to the Grand Campaign. If it's I have I been... stupid rule mid session. I have found so many stupid rules here and. <laughs> <laughs> there are, yeah. uh, right. I still send the PCOSI. Say it again. Look, you're not what? gonna hold the lobby hostage. <laughs> yeah, I gotta send it. I can say I now. I gotta send you're not gonna here. hold the lobby hostage. Here. I, I like see your point, lie. and this is the only time it ha matters, but at the same time, uh, I, I mean, if I change the rule mid-session, it's unfair to the other players on the other end of the peace deal. Yeah, but it Let's doesn't make any sense. If I change the rules mid-session... able to take the province that is not occupied. If I change rules... You can do it in, again, I made a save, I can show you. AI would accept that peace deal. 
Because they don't but have how a how does it matter with AI? If I change you, you can do it in the What kind of is that? That's what the rule was based from. Sure, you can petition to change that rule by next session, uh, by next campaign, or even next session. Uh, by that point, sure, if it passes, it passes, we change the rules. Sure However, I can't change rules mid-session, that's unfair. Are you sure oh, AI is on? Is the AI uh, brain dead? I probably won't be as it is. Rio's time. Yeah, I've been <laughs> getting two piece deals. Ah, oh, for God's sake. Right. Before we get an emergency rehost, is there anyone I can drag in last second to accept a peace deal for me? Um... Oh, of course, if I drag anyone in last second to accept a peace deal, they're not going to have the game. They're not going to have the monitor, so right? Yeah. Oh, Christ, we're going to have to rehost. Mm. Right, rehost again. Woo, for last hour and a half, or at least at this point, last hour. We love the rehosts. Right. Uh, Portugal fucked up with their settings, so it's brain dead. Rehost. Nice. Rehost. Right. What? Done. Yeah, Port ah! Portugal's thanking the lobby. Portugal's ah! done. thanking the lobby. Okay. Right. right. Hi, rehost. Join me in room one. Okay. Ah, that was too quick. Sorry. Hello, rehost. Join me in room one. Uh, room two. Room one. Whatever. That moves. Paused by Bowen. Yeah. Which is oh, great. because I need Fred to get slaughtered oh. in this battle. Oh, because that was <laughs> I was. Wait, I, was the, I thought we were I was the first one to exit. <laughs> you were, but everyone's quitting now. So. Yep. Yeah. I you were the I, first I one to ask. Wait, what do I? How much do I need to white piece someone? Like sixty. Sixty. Yeah, white so piece. it's fifty to take one almost, but it's sixty for a force white piece. So basically, because well, as soon as you can enforce, you can take more. This is from an earlier argument where Aaron got screwed over by having only fifty to white piece. All right, so can I just stab it him out at fifty then? Oh, you can start stab it in. That's fine, yeah. but you can't. Uh, you can't force, pause, and enforce, if that makes sense. Yeah. I gotta go. I can't come back. Who? Very sad. The Sylvania. I mean, within is that, so it doesn't really matter. How no. did you manage oh. to kill the Sylvania? They were literally the strongest country last session. Oh, no, 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 no. If you'd have said that two it? seconds ago, we wouldn't have had to re <laughs> Yeah, you could have, if you said that three <laughs> seconds ago, you could have <laughs> tagged into Portugal accepted the peace deal. Oh. Oh, um. <laughs> so. Yeah, I'm actually glad Portugal didn't accept because I forgot to break his relation with France. But, you know. Well, now you can definitely take 100%. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah, I can take 100 now. Let's go. Not 98. Oh, there right. you go. Look at that. This is the most powerful one. All right, so why did everyone move into our group chat? Because well, I did. Because I said feel free to join us for the rehost. Oh, why are you invading my room too? <laughs> I saw this was room one. Yo, um, this is room two. This is where the gamers hang out. Oh, two no. done. You should have, I thought that was room eight. Nah. Should no. done. Should have done what I did. Just one. <laughs> Sorry. I'm... Lemon cake. Yes. Yeah. It clearly states in the rule you cannot force peace for promises that are not occupied. Are you serious? Yeah, rule seven. Oh, for fuck's sake. Well, you cannot force peace for promises that are not occupied. I remember the rules <laughs> last time being. Alright, I'll move down the channel, you guys win. I'll move over. over. That you control. Get me the fuck out. Colonial and overseas lands exempt from this. Let's see. Uh, colonial and overseas, this is overseas land. It's not. Is. It's Europe. Yeah, Everything it's... is Europe. Everything that no, is overseas it's... has been it's removed from the game. Oh, it's an island. I hate saying this, but he can rule Norris and say that, yeah. I think he's actually right. Because really, the... okay, the last rule required only in the four. And yeah, it's, of course, it's... To that rule, yeah. Overseas. Wow. It is over eight. It's overseas. It's not I love how I just look on the top overseas. right where like 10 people join in the rules document, but Cookie, you're right. No, he's not right though. He actually because is right. It's, overseas it's not overseas by strict game definitions of what overseas is. It's a European it is. province. It's no. It's a European that's, province. It's, it's literally over a C. I. It's a rules lawyering moment. It's as if this was a, if this was a you know if this was D and D instead of a player, I'd be very sad at him. But 
he's technically right. It's says we're enforcing law. But enforcing he's law also law. not right because he is correct. Overseas. I'm afraid you can't enforce for the islands. Literally overseas. What do you mean? Cookie, come back. No, you're everything right. that's overseas has been. I apologize, Cookie. Me. You're right. He can only enforce for the yeah. It's, it's an island. Overseas. It's in Europe, so it's not overseas. So because we're doing rules law, I think he's right. Uh, actually, no, it is. It's part of the African nope. uh, thing. Nope. It's part it of the is, Africa, but it's part of the European continent. But because it's part again, of the, the algorithm African I ran generating this world, everything in the European part of the world, if it comes And it's region. in the West African Sea. It so is in the in West the African, African Sea, which is part sea. of Europe, so it doesn't count as overseas. <laughs> it's part of Europe, it's part of Africa, bro. It's the name. If it was part of Africa, it wouldn't be in this mod. This mod specifically deletes every province that's not part of Europe. So if it's here, it's in one. Europe. Apart from that one in, like, you know, Borneo or whatever, but we don't talk about that. Bro, Cookie? That's, that's... Yes. Is, yes. No. Impressive rules, Roaring, but you're actually that, that right. Is Feel free not to come right. back. Yeah, it's, it's correct. I'm sorry. Okay, then I just want forest peace. Uh, in that... Oh, Christ, that's true. He can't... The issue is Cookie. Yes, he can not force peace waiting for you to on -con. That is the uh, thing he can do. Because the only method for you to prevent from your entire country being occupied and being bankrupt is uh, you have to peace during Uncon, but it's not Uncon. Yeah, so yeah. I don't have to peace out. So I'll just keep you occupied. Um, yeah, well, forward. Cookie, you know what? I apologize, but fair enough, you're right. <laughs> okay, well, the, good luck because, being Yeah, the, when the rules was a different Google Docs document, it got changed, and I remember the old one better, but yep, yeah, fair enough. Credit is where credit is due. Right, is there anyone we care about in here? Ah, oh, the Suenia did uh, did rage quit because they think the Suenia is dead now, so... Rip. Why did he rage quit? I didn't. And I got completely dismembered. Uh, because he thinks his country is dead now, so uh, well done. Bowen. <laughs> You're doing good. Matt sounds up for me, but yeah. At least you're going to have Polish feeding time now. Although I think the off game here as well. Uh, right, is everyone in who we care about? I think so. Uh, Austria ready up. Is England in there? No, England is dead. Actually dead. There are 75 autonomy and losing independence all to Scotland. Okay, so we left. Austria no. ready up. Austria <laughs> ready up. Castile, Castile, Castile. You can't Castile is great, but Austria needs to ready up. He's dirty, dirty Frenchman. <laughs> I, well, as much I as I agree with the testimony about the Frenchman, <laughs> can you can the Austria player ready up? Yeah, I'm, oh, I'm my Austria ready. player again. <laughs> I know it's the, it's the curse of the Austria player. Is this Austria player also going to be a furry? Let's find out. Oh golly. <laughs> oh, I was tabbed out. Well, Caraman pulled through. Yay! But there we go. Uh, oh, let's change the rule. I was tabbed out lemon. The, I mean, I guess actually, honestly, after it was fine. <laughs> because it oh, all works the day. battle started. Right. Ah, oh, I love the drama. <laughs> Any constellation, there's only an hour left. Bro, tell me. I yeah, almost just clicked a band so game. Technically, an hour and ten. Well. I almost just clicked a band game as well. So there we go. All oh, right. Right, there you go. I, uh, I gotta, I gotta... Australia, let's go. Make you wanna decision. do it now? I'm gonna make a decision here. Mm. You wanna die with Ooh. this player? Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah, um... Where, where are these other... You Should maybe I... win the battle, but lose the war. Yeah, yeah, yeah. let me win the battle first. <laughs> I gotta, I gotta... <laughs> I know, I gotta win the... I gotta... Uh... You know, I get to You're not gonna like. So. You are gonna take the white piece. Yeah, I am. I'm about to go bankrupt. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I took the new. I've got, I've got a higher priority spending than you. Also, huh? what the hell is happening with Georgia? What the hell is George? What What is George doing? Uh, I think it's a humiliation war. I know, but why? Bro, <laughs> they just they points. They can't I humiliate think... Venice. They can't get to Venice. I want to go ask the Georgia player? You make a fair point. The Georgia player is here, because everyone's here again. Fair enough. Hello, everyone. Georgia, what the <laughs> hell are you doing? <laughs> You're muted, He's been way. muted for a while. Ah, fair. He's been possessed, and that's what's taken over. 
Damn it. I <laughs> thought I'm only gonna get rules loaded in DMD, doing... but it turns out I'm getting rules loaded in goddamn E4 as well. He's doing the funny, is what he said. He's doing the funny, okay. Well, not gonna lie, Georgia, when I thought you downed that, what I thought you were gonna do is that, oh, I'm gonna go fight the Spanish, so I'm gonna walk my troops through the wasteland. That was gonna farmer. be the funny. That's what I expected it to be, but no, you're actually just downing. That would have been funnier. That would have been funnier. I guess I may have given it away slightly now. There we go. Oh, don't worry, Castile, you're saved. You've got Simony. But there we go. All right. Yeah, no. Uh, uh, this has he accepted no, the peace? Or is he not there? It's a bit of a rip for Austria now, then. Oh, well. Yeah. Yeah. You when you declare war on me, you're not going to run from it. The problem is, I kind of agree. Eric is scary. He is scary. Yeah. Right, but there we go. Arik is the Lysteris that shows up. <laughs> oh Christ, okay, well there goes that on. I'm surprised again about this. Very interesting play by a tank that's not Protestant. <laughs> that is going to give them a subjugation of Rome. Should we modify, I believe? Yeah, they got, they got bigger fresh fry, but they guess two dip. Well, actually, two dip wrappers. But then again, they don't hold it, which isn't pretty. I guess it's trade power. Woo! I'm assuming they're nicking it, right? I oh, think they're nicking the trade power. Yeah, I'm not sure why the hell they're doing that, but there we go. Well. Oh, they're not going to go bankrupt, are they? They just, they can actually live entirely off of Tenerife. Uh. Oh dear, sorry for the stream, I, I tapped out reading it all. But yeah, of course, you can entirely live off in a reef now and actually just be the colonial empire. You can do a Brazil exodus and basically be annoying with that. In fairness, you can even... I mean, he has a surprisingly decent navy at that. Yeah, heavy and... I mean, this is good, but fleet engagement, when you only have five heavies, isn't actually great. Um, but there we go, yeah. That's... Honestly, if I were to do this modifier again, and this is probably going to encourage this kind of playstyle more, I don't know if I want to encourage playstyle or not, is actually give this a naval force summit modifier as well. But there we go. Another thing as well I have to ask is, how is the Portuguese inflation doing? Um, quite badly, given that they are quote-unquote relying on New World Gold, but there we go. No question is, can I still going to hit... Um, seems to be no. But the thing is, since they only have 17k right now... Christ, and every single loan out of the sun. Um, <laughs> they need to revoke a burger, burger privilege and grant them the burger loans to start. Oh, want to see declare bankruptcy. Mm, yeah, that's going to be pretty. But what isn't pretty, of course, is I think the Austrians are going to get the short end of the stick here. And, yeah. And if I were to gather what they would be doing, is probably something very brutal like this. I mean, they're about to have a piece of their entire coalition. Yeah, so that would... They can enforce for something like this. That would be brutal. I mean, or they can just they be, be nice to me and give me nice borders, but it will be one of those that's not really happening. Surprisingly low on AE, but... Given how much they can take here and not have to face the entire world. But I guess that is the entire remnants of the world. Very set up Platinum, he's got beaten up a lot, and depressing the entire time he's been beaten up by AI. So there we go. And what the hell has happened? Well, I guess Brandenburg's had a bit of a comeback.
And there we go. Alright, 46, 60 can enforce, but... Yeah, but okay. Unfortunately, that's going to be... Oh, no. That's a Florence. Hey. Break with Hungary. Hey, break with Bohemia. That might be the, uh, the players there. Actually, yep. Back to the other quiz I forgot. Quality. Okay. That's a five, yep. And Serbia took quality. That's a... Oh, wow. That makes the earlier 9-7 popularity a lot worse. That's a 9-7-6. Nine, nine, seven, There we go. Oh, that would be nice to them. However, did Eric take the piece too? I think did he piece out the French? No. Ah! He pieced out with Savoy. That was the backstab. The Austria Savoy. Mm. Yeah, but there goes Genoa. Does this prevent Sardinia Piedmont, though, is the issue? It does not. But I. Oh, Mountain Powerhouse means. Yep. Yeah, okay. I can still get there for percent an efficiency in this produced mission. However, I'm going to call it. What I think Florence is going to do here is. I know. With Hungary and Bohem or Bohemia. And that'll be the end of that. Pretty a massive uh, knockdown for a year. For them, but there we go. Well, best of luck with that whole development. Right. Onto the advanced they go. Yes, hello. I can play uh, I, for the session I, I and then return to, to my country for the next session. I, I gotta, I gotta go. Uh, so the planet, like, killed himself already. So he's gonna sub. Hey, Portugal. No, still. Yeah, no, I, I know you have to go. Who's going to sub for you, sir? Platinum. Yeah, yeah I do. Yeah. That's fair. I'm. Yeah. Yeah, fair enough. Yeah. Uh, but... Will, yeah, will the original can still player be uh, back next week? Then I, I can return so, to yes. the Platinum. Oh, I, I gotta go. Yeah. yeah so do I, I just leave and then? I very much recommend your initiative for returning to Platinum, by the way. Yep. Uh, Thank you. Yeah. Can you, uh, you can, can we continue well, so I can win this battle? Yeah. Quit and hot join. Yeah. yeah. I will be making a save in case dodgy things happen right now, but I'm not unforced. Uh, do not unforced. Yeah. It's it's way. okay. It's okay. My my country has ten years of truce with all its neighbors. Anyway, so. Okay. Oh, thank you. It if, will if, be the if, same if, next if week. If AI decides to get rid of your entire idea group and take influence ideas, I can nation fix as well. Don't worry. <laughs> uh, don't unpause right now, by the way. Um, there's a... Uh, yeah. Platina is going to sub Castile for the last hour. So there you go. That's gotcha. it, basically. But, so I don't. I want to avoid a rehost. So don't unpause because I will cause a rehost if AI is going to take influence ideas and get rid of quantity. Um, there we go. Mm. Okay, I just told them to not unpause, so there we go. And like all of Germany is 
his AI basically at this point still. Yeah, I think I'm actually looking at Brandenburg and I'm thinking I can nation fix and get another player on there. <laughs> yeah, I mean, after this, uh, I'll just have anyway. a truce with them now. <laughs> yeah, I know, but our nation fix enough to them enough where they won't be able to kill us or die for you. Yeah. Although I don't have the AE go, is the issue. Yeah. I think honestly they've they kind of migrated, but I think Brandenburg is actually a viable tank that's just exists there. I hope you don't mind too much of it, so I don't have to play again. Well, I mean not playing it next week anyway, so I don't care. Fair. Okay, so what what was the plan for Castile? Uh plan for Castile is uh well that guy's left he he... Don't die, you have a truce with everyone who threatens you. You're yeah, running max yeah. occupying Portugal. However, you want Tenerife in that piece too. That's what you really want. However, to take Tenerife you're gonna to need to occupy it in peace. You need, you need to have occupy. we changed the rule then? Or I see. No, okay. I, it turns out I've read the rules yeah. and it turns out he was right. Cookie's right. Was he? Yeah. Oh. That's actually yay. in the rules. So uh no he's right. <laughs> it's a very nice rules lawyering. <laughs> oh, yeah, nice it's a rules <laughs> lawyering because it's a overseas province. So you can, uh, if that Iceland, if that island was like Borneo, you could take it without a fort. But because it's not an overseas province, by the definition of the overseas province, because it's a plainly in Europe, you can't take it. That is actually hilarious. That is the dumbest rule of I've seen, and I have a play again, I've played you the Indians at the DM, and I have one of my players' rule lawyers, so you know, I know right. how bad it gets. But at the same time, he's correct. So, yeah. Okay. Sorry, I was, having a, I was having a like a little rant. That is but actually no. hilarious. He is actually right because it's not an overseas province. Can is we it, um, pause now, please? Uh, yes, I need to. However, turn off the AI for cast you. Yep. Thank you. Okay. So... There we go. Yeah. That is hilarious, though. He is technically correct. <laughs> he can live entirely. It was such Earth. a big thing about it as well. <laughs> he was right. Yeah. No, that, that's the thing. He, he did this thing called reading the rules. What a genius. Because again, yeah, to yeah. clarify, uh, you count for peaceful promises that are not occupied or near a fort you control. Colonial and overseas land are exempt from this rule, but it's not a colonial or overseas province. Why are you colonial or overseas provinces? Because you know how, because then, like, you're not going to go bother. If you, let's say you're, you're going to try and full annex a player, right? And let's say it's Portugal, oh. you're not going to go. It, you shouldn't have to go to goddamn Madagascar to siege out, like, a random three development island, right? But Especially if you want to discovered. take Madagascar, then surely you should. Well, we decided a lot earlier that you shouldn't, hence why. That. Okay. Because otherwise... Why does the sky... If you have a fort in Madagascar, okay, it's a relevant place, then sure, but if not, then it's, you know, it's a three dev, it shouldn't prevent a full annex, right? Yeah. So that was the original okay, point fine. of the rule. And obviously it has never mattered until now, before I gave <laughs> a Reef that beautiful modifier. <laughs> but there we go. Uh, my only conclusion is I have no regrets. But no, Cookie's right. Credit where credit is due. Uh, also, another thing is I might. How do you think of playing Scotland? Because I currently beat up England in their. Yeah, yeah, no, they're, they're I might definitely might be playable. able to like nation. If you gave them. Not shit ideas. More than one ad yeah, one more than one admin idea, they'd probably be okay. Are you telling me that open administrative is not the best thing to do in an MP in an MP lobby? Because actually, I don't know, actually, Scottish ideas aren't too bad. 33% Oh, yeah, no, Scottish it. ideas are lovely. I will say that. It's, it's probably worse saying. than Ireland, but... No, 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 they're worse. The issue is they're worse than GB and Ireland, right? So mm. that I think if you have probably Scottish ideas... Probably better than GBs, I'd say. 20% because GB like... for GB is good. Yeah, but unless you're going for, like, the mean naval shit or whatever. They also, I don't think they have discipline in their ideas as well, which is an, an issue, yeah. Right, okay, why are we pause now? Pause. It's taken me about two hours to fucking kill Holland. <laughs> oh, it's Austria. Oh, it's Austria. Oh, he unconned. Yeah, that's fair. Okay, I turn. Oh. Okay. How many gold mines can you take? <laughs> no, the thing is, you can do something worse. You can make them an always hungry. Oh, that's not that bad, that, to be honest. Uh, I think the best way is to annul treaties and release as much as possible, so they get fucked they don't have AI. Any... He can take land, though, but yeah, it's so apparent. I personally think he wouldn't know, but I mean, that's what I would do, but I don't know. <laughs> okay, he did it, the absolute legend, he took to roll. He, he released it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he didn't, he just released it. Yeah. Wait, and what did you Treviso. even do? He took Treviso, which is fair. 
Oh, yeah, was it Venice? You know what you should have done? You should have given Berlin back to uh, Brandenburg because I would have received it. <laughs> oh, man. Thank you, Eric. You released Tyrol. When I return to the Palatinate, that will help me. <laughs> <laughs> okay, uh, I'll say another thing. First of all, Platinum, I don't know how the hell you have managed to expand, Rudy. I mean, I guess the answer uh, is because he, he lost he almost the yeah, Meanwhile, I did try and help. massive everyone... respect, genuinely. Like, yeah. I can now trust yeah. you on, on like more important tags in the future. Yeah, no, that is quite, that is very cool. I can now trust you on future tags. So, yeah. And the thing is, I have absolutely no idea about the multiplayer meta. I have three thousand hours in single player, and that's it. Ah, yeah, that's how well, I. Well, you've gone quite well. economic. So if this was unmodded, this is, this would be excellent. But you know, <laughs> I mean, again, you've done everything right in that regard. But normally. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> I can't call anything bad I've seen, it's just the yeah, coalition, I think, fired a bit. I don't know quite why it fired, because it was quite a small one. No, it was enough Be to fair. kill them, and if, if it's enough to kill you, they fire it. I've just realized, of course, Gasto is going to get caught for pizza. So he is going to be able to, he's going to be forced to peace out Portugal without taking Tenerife, unless he can somehow make his way over to Tenerife. I think yeah, the thing is, for them to I don't know why um, this guy on Castile has taken so many loans. Because, I have he just, in... because he just fought the entirety of France, and Italy, and everything, and the reason he yeah. managed to get a white piece is because he spent 100k ducats. Ah, oh, I see. <laughs> so basically, I'm raising Portugal to bankrupt slower than me, uh, faster than me. Um, well, that's not going to work because you're going to get caught for pizza faster. And there's your bankruptcy. I see. So, I think, unfortunately... Never mind! Of course, the Portuguese... I think, yeah, you can see that. What can we see? The Lollard heretics have risen up in Tenerife. <laughs> All so 23,000 of them. Oh, jeez. Does that mean he can... I mean, he can no, he can't because it's not occupied, but he is about to lose occupation of Tenerife. Oh. Oh. Also, an interesting fact is it's now only 53% war score, so he can't actually... Uh, he can't actually even get a white piece now. Wait, why did I lose the, the war score? I do not know, but you have. Because <laughs> France, he called in France. Interesting. He yeah. called in France. <laughs> oh, Christ. Oh, oh for fuck's sake, man. Oh, you're now fighting the French, and you're about to move back up. This will be a learning experience. <laughs> so now, uh, he, his um, country, he has no Lax loans, and he's bankrupt in 40 years, and he has 23k men. I wouldn't stress about it. Wait a second. Um, it's Did better France than just being break the, France just freeze break, didn't Nope. It's, he did it's it. a defensive war, so there is no truce break. Ah, oh, for God's sake, of course that's the way he did that. And so yeah, you can't get a white piece now. Uh, can someone explain what's going on in Portugal? Portugal so... called in Portu France because it's a defensive war which bypasses the truce. Uh, Wait, the you... white piece? Did... I really don't want to explain this to the Castile player when he gets back. Don't worry. It's no. fine. Just blame, it's just blame, blame just blame Thingy. <laughs> yep. Well, um... Blame, uh... You're in the HRE anyway, it's gonna be fine. Yeah. Well, I'm not worried about my country to Palatinate. I'm worried about Castile now, because I yeah, am responsible now. Castile's dead. Uh, apparently, I think Yeah, don't, don't he, blame uh, yourself. I think it's not your fault. <laughs> I think they would have done it even if Ryan was so, uh, the magic to so Yeah, so and the same thing would have happened. Without prosperity. Quite cool. Their only chance there would have been just to take Max from Portugal bankruptcy and rely on that France rely on the France truce. Although it's a five year truce, so yeah. I mean I could stab at him for a white piece and then I have truce. Oh yeah, do that. You that's can stab at him, yeah, that's fair. I'd do that, definitely. You can stab hitting it's a quite a good idea. It's stab hit it's stab hit yes, fine. Plus three stab though. So it's gonna take a while. That was worth a shot anyway, probably. Ah, don't worry, he's now Mace? losing major amounts of money because his, his Tenerife is occupied by uh, Lollard Heretics. Uh, yeah, and they're transferring, so I don't know if you can accept them. Because on Tenerife is... Is that your capital? Nope. No. And they're transferring to Lisbon there. Yeah, your only bet... That's, that's your actually best bet good. Is to start that's with actually good. Stab at him out for white pieces is your only bet. Gonna ally my best friend now, Tyrol. <laughs> no, don't please. <laughs> now we need to make sure Austria is dead after this. 
Yeah, quite Not gonna possibly. lie, I'm pretty sure Ostra is the greatest, the strongest stack right now. Well, I would, but yeah. Because Emperor is strong. <laughs> oh my god, what the hell have they done to Lithuania? I guess that's... Uh, what's up with the men? Uh, they released. Oh good god. No, that would have been Rebels. You might yeah. need to be nice. That's a tag. Apart from Kiev, oh yeah. That's a And <laughs> <laughs> Loads of people... Oh no, all the new tags, of course. Like, Tyrol has a... Because Tyrol exists, Tyrol can now press a decision to subscribe to Lemon Cake, so they get a claim on Kiev. <laughs> I took almost 10% of my loans. Oh yeah, fun oh, fact no. for everyone, just as a spoiler effect, right? Because of the way I've coded it, and I'm bad. Uh, if you form a new tag, because you, you don't do have the again, country flam that you haven't subscribed to, that you've subscribed to Lemon Cake before, you can subscribe to Lemon Cake again for another I actually point. think that's quite cool though, to be fair. It adds a nice little, like, that's a right, nice listen. little mechanic. Any that, tag you ever form again. But, if you form a tag that's already informed, so like Burgundy formed France, because France already took it, you won't be able to take it again. Ah, oh, that's... That's one. Let me go over here. How long does snap hits take? Uh, three months. Nah, just decline them manually. Yeah, let's do that. Especially when it's only 50 wars for now. They stab it at 40, right? No, 50. Ah, uh, but if he can, he can skill that ulster stack, he probably can get a bit more score squeezed out. But there we go. Well, that's all up to you. Side. Ooh. Yeah. Oh no, the the original. Uh, I'm afraid to say the song for it, but the original Castile player is watching this. <laughs> <laughs> What's he saying? Uh, grief. grief. I think he's sad. Oh dear. Well, better than it being AI, I, I imagine. Because, <laughs> um. Alright, well. There goes Georgia. Terracos, Lithuania. I mean, Lithuania is dead, but. He think... bankrupt. Oh, is this a. Oh, it's a no. war. No, it's. Why are they. Well, FD... Wait a minute. They're kind of in a war against a player. Hold up. And they were winning that war as well, Christ. What? Well, I guess that's a nice thing for Karaman here. There we go. So, if the Castile player is watching this, why aren't they playing the... Uh... Can't. It's rather poor excuse. Ah, I see. Well, you know, you can you can look at a you can look at a stream on your phone. Doesn't mean you can be here for a four-hour session. Mm -hmm. You know. I can just hear about five lemon cakes in the background. <laughs> Excellent. <laughs> really yes. I am breathing. Ah, <laughs> oh, there we go. All right. Well, I will leave you be. I hope you know what you're doing. And Castile, I believe in you. Yeah, I thank believe you. in thank you, you too. Thank you. Uh, by the way, just to clarify, the Ming and Chicago Knights are still banned in, in this lobby as well. In case you want to play <laughs> me. I, I am here to grieve. <laughs> Yeah, I'm sorry. It had to happen. Uh, but uh, I'm I'm kind of annoyed that the they accepted peace with you without like knowing treaties or anything. I think he would have died. I would not have accepted that. You would have that. been dead. Yeah, fair enough. But like, <laughs> the, if they were gonna peace out of you at all, then it shouldn't have been for a white peace because that. You would have just yeah. gone in again. Yeah, you, uh, as you, I, I mean, as you did, you went in again. <laughs> yeah, this time to save Portugal. Oh, yeah. Uh, Except him to expect I mean, him that, to attack that, Portugal. That's fair enough. Wait, heretic rebels don't in. give you. They only give you. Oh, local tax, manpower modify, monthly autonomy. They don't actually give you autonomy. So it's not the end of the world. Although that minus thirty percent tax kind of hurts. Yeah, good question. Who's going to get colonialism? Me. Uh, literally anyone, actually. Yeah. Um, well, including we, every in that like province. Have four provinces? Yes, so the, it's the same chance per province. Every, right, it's around province in the game will, will get colonials. So, so who has the, the most provinces? Is that all? Would it be possible to spawn it on Tenerife? 
It would be. Yep, it would be, comes. yeah. You'd have to be very yeah, lucky, though. It's not going to spread the very same well. chance of falling <laughs> on Tenerife is the same chance of spawning on literally the, the center of the city. So that, that is highly unlikely. <laughs> the fun thing is that it wouldn't spread the, from Tenerife. That would be hilarious. It would stay on the islands. Well, yes, yes, yes it would. Anyway, well, yeah. so have fun. You're going to have to it. <laughs> okay, if I make it the next version of Smod, I'll make it so the Colonials can only spawn in Kiev. No, I'll make it the only problem is to <laughs> colonialism, and this will be the uh, the big political statement to, to make save me from annexation to Kiev. It's the goddamn Azov slave province. <laughs> That's the only uh, the requirement for spawning colonialism oh, is to be producing I'm slaves. I'm actually stupid. No, I don't say that. I'm sure you're very smart. No, I so. am. Because I seized a province off. Oh, um, so they're disloyal, so you can't annex them. So now I have to... No, well, I, I made sure I, they weren't disloyal, so, but now I have to core it myself, <laughs> now that I've integrated them. Uh, well, at least they're not getting unlawful territory. That's true, that's true. Well, it's pretty nice. How high of a chance do I have I of think my, Rhino's also my country be being playable? <laughs> well, zero. Uh, cool. I think Scorch of Scotland is an excellent reseed opportunity, is your answer to that. And I'm going to add nation <laughs> a bit. Uh, no, it's not. Wait, hey, what? France, can you stay out of uh, Sweden, Sweden, what I'm are you doing to my reseed? Sweden, I was going to reseed that. <laughs> Sweden, what are you doing? I was going to reseed a player there. Sweden. <laughs> That's I don't work out in Sweden. That's so Chad. Sweden, what are you doing? <laughs> no, Sweden. That's Chad. I Chad. need somewhere to play. No. <laughs> Sweden, you have the entirety of Scandinavia. Sweden, what are you doing? Okay, um... I'll probably finish fix the Bavaria or a... Uh, oh, I'll have a Brandenburg back up and ready. You could, maybe you should fix um, Uh... What's it called? Opponent, <laughs> or... Well, I'm returning to it next. Yeah, or is so that? Probably, yeah, I, you know what? I think because he's nice and playing a tag and sacrifice it, then I found as sure I will give you a couple more ideas and catch up on tech and maybe return a couple course to you. Is there anything yeah, that I left. Oh, be able okay. to play? I'll return a couple claims to you. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you very much. <laughs> Uh, but I re actually don't want to be rewarded for stupidity, but yeah. Yeah, I think it's just in the spirit of keeping you a viable tag. Yeah. I mean, my my first goal was to survive the first session, and I I did that. So. That well. yeah. My you know goal what? was to survive against Aragon. It it Scotland will not be a reseed, but what I'm going to do is I'm going to make a mega whales. <laughs> oh my god, yes. <laughs> Just so give all cool. of, like, Wales to, um... Sorry, all of England to Wales. You know what, that's no, Wales, Wales, that's a, that's a... It's gonna be Irish culture. Oh, Christ. Okay, no, we're not what doing that. Cornwall? We're gonna give it to Cornwall. Yes. Cornwall. Oh my god. Oh, that's also Irish. Why is it all Irish? It's not even Cornwall. You converted a fair bit. That's not even Welsh Pause anymore. Just, yeah, that's not Welsh Pause. No. Why don't you make a custom nation of London? A custom nation of uh, uh, or... super. Yes, I'll make a custom nation on London. Watch Super Scotland. I oh, know, I'll make a custom Thank nation you. on London called Scotland 2. Why don't you make it your uh, Ruthenian culture? Why? What's your obsession of spreading that Ruthenian culture? <laughs> okay, you know what, actually? I'm... I'm, I'm gonna I'm gonna make an island island reseed and I'll compensate the French vassals by giving them some English provinces in the mainland. Damn. Cold. And call that as fair. And then I'll make an island to island fascination. Or something like that. I'll think of that. I want I want to reseed into an England power, even if it's just gonna be something it's an island. I uh, I'd take anything I can get, to be honest. Excellent. <laughs> uh no, you know what? Fine, you're getting my Xantium. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, yes, please. <laughs> uh, Sweden, did you it... just sack the city, <laughs> the city of Look, Edinburgh? It, if you can make <laughs> Byzantium playable, oh, I'll, I'll do it for the mission. No, I'm unfortunately my back and Florence have already taken Is Edinburgh in... Okay, I got confused uh, right. as to which side Edinburgh was on. <laughs> in uh, Edinburgh is uh, currently the side that's been burnt down by the Swedish. Right, okay. Makes sense. 
Yep, yeah, well, it looks like Portugal is back to fight another day. Very cool. I'm still alive. <laughs> Yay. Oh, Lord. Have mercy in our souls. What have we created? But there we go. Well, I'll look at I'll look at races. I'll look at what's going on. Worst comes to us, I probably with people dipping, so we'll need subs. Uh, so I now actually yeah. have the most of uh, of the English Channel. <laughs> well, yes, because every other province there has an autonomy of hundred and five percent. He did tell me not to take uh, any more in the in the English Channel, but he I did? decided to say fuck it. <laughs> Who told you? Uh, Rhino. No, Rhino. Oh, I'm sure it'd be fine. Oh, he told you to not do that because he was going to form Hanover or something, wasn't he? Well, no, it was more because I think he's scared of Ypsilon, but like... Oh, but... Ypsilon said it was fine, so I thought I should just do it. And that's probably added a good, like, two or three... In but don't forget, me. even if Ypsilon dows you, you're going to have at least an Austrico villager helping you. Just I will, you that is true, and, and Austria is a bit grumpy at the moment, uh, with... The French. I mean, it's so far. Yeah. It's the one that affects a fucking it coalition is. war. <laughs> oh. oh, man. Oh, Kazan's in a player war against uh, Castle Defender of Faith. Okay, Kazan is longer in a player war. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh, and also, ah, it looks like yeah, uh, Florence is taking a bit so, of a the there. Yeah, Glitch, I'm very sorry, but I can't save this. Uh, no. Yeah, I can't, I can't touch this, bro. I blame whoever accepted the French peace. That is, um... That is your uh, arrogant Mr. player. That's what, that's the arrogant called. player. Yeah. Well, I, yes, I'm glad played Ruining me still. because I killed him and <laughs> can't believe it. He did incredibly well on you, but... Yeah. Oh, I'm kind of happy that he yeah, played yeah, still yeah. because he didn't play Bavaria. <laughs> yeah, true. So far the most he... time coming together. He did well up until the point where he accepted oh. French. If it's only consolation, England has gone to exploration, so... Has, has it actually? Yeah. Oh, dear. <laughs> oh no. Uh, <laughs> has there been any other AI that's done it? Yeah. Um, well, at least we're going to get to 50-50. So, can we have our bets? Three, 300 monarch points if you correct guess correctly the country. Colonials are sponsored. I got it. I want it as well. I know you want it. Guess correctly. If you if you submit a guess and you're wrong, you will lose 10 prestige. It's going to spawn in Stockholm. It's going to spawn in Augsburg. I still think Tenerife is the way. <laughs> that would be so funny because I'd actually give it... Like, what does it give? 5 trade power? 10 trade power, I think. I bet, it spawns, I bet it spawns in like fucking Bavaria or some shit. Like oh, it's, it's gonna exam. spawn in Kiev. If I make this one again, it's I'm gonna, gonna make spawn it in. Oh, for it absolutely! To be Kiev. It's Why gonna spawn in Herzegovina. In yeah. You know what? You're all wrong. We all know that the true province that's gonna spawn colonial. If you want me to be over Castile, you can earn calm. Ah, uh, I guess I can. Yeah. You don't have to earn calm. You, you don't have to. Calm. That is true. You will yeah. win eventually, anyway. Yeah. Well, well I mean, I, I can I can fight to the last man, but... I will be griefing for the next week. Oh, yeah, where I'm is sorry. that gonna go? There will be wow. one game where we... Where we... Remember, uh, to, your gambles are approaching. Because they will got basically spawn in 15 Six months. months. Yeah. It'd be funny if, if it... It'd be funny if it just doesn't spawn anywhere for the first month and we have to wait till the second one. <laughs> Uh, it does have sometimes, yeah. It does have sometimes. Yeah, but the thing is, I think the chances of that happening are incredibly low because every single I mean, I could, I could important. count all the provinces and work it out, but I don't think I'm going to do that. If it spawns on Malta, it's just not going to spread to anyone. Spawn, uh, spread to Aragon, won't it? Nope, because it's an island. So I, I skipped it. I didn't. Does want it not spread me. across islands? Nope. Yeah. Oh. Because no, oh, okay. I guess sorry, bordering. Yeah, if it spawns on any of the four islands, it's gone. Which four? Sorry. Uh, across the four like islands in uh, of the Portuguese mainland. Oh yeah, and um, oh no, not um, 
Not Iceland. Iceland's fine. Hmm. Also, is everyone looking forward to the Burgundy inheritance? I wonder who's going to get it. Well, it's not going to happen. It's not going to happen, unfortunately. Alright, it's June this time. It would it's happen because I get free cores. Yeah. Ooh, but he fucked cool. up this country by not getting it anyway. So he has to manually integrate all the subjects. Well, it looks like I'm reseeding a custom nation uh, commonwealth, uh, uh, Cornwall. <laughs> Oh so god. Do. Yeah, I mean... Is that really a wise choice? Um, I'm gonna give them a 15 year truce advance, so yes. Yes, but I will just eat the rest of England. <laughs> mm. I'm about to lose to an AI I in a war. Are you them. kidding me? Who are you? Savoy. Well, you did get your entire army. Yeah. Soldiers, so, maybe? Get wrecked. Ypsilon, can I not die to you twice in one campaign? Thanks. Um, I don't know, man. That's, uh, that's, like, a tough, what was the first that's, time? Well, this, like... Well, Castile. Ca Castile. No, what? So Castile twice, then? Yeah. No, uh, if he put, gets put on wheels... Because oh, right. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah. You know, I'm gonna nation fix the Brandenburg and call that a day. Oh yeah, Brandenburg's uh, managed to... <laughs> they've, uh, they've integrated the ring here. I, I entirely died because of France, not... Mm, Portugal, it did, I would have beaten easily. Well, yeah. Well, well actually, I, I wouldn't be that, sh that certain of that, to be perfectly honest with you. I think there would have mm. been a, a decent chance he would have won. Well, as you saw, Castile literally smashed Portugal. Yeah, he, like, yeah. Which was still yeah, interesting, yeah. because... What player was I just yeah. couldn't get fucking Tenerife. <laughs> you should have just got your losses, I guess, but okay. Yeah, I I wasn't in charge of the country. <laughs> yeah, fair. To be well, honest, you know, I would have. You live. You live. At you that learn. point, yeah, okay. I would have probably just uh, forced for ninety eight yeah, on the main, and then take them. Yeah, if you did, that, that, France would have doubted you, and probably returned course to Portugal, or probably not, and let the Portuguese live on the islands for it. They I mean, no, I would have let the Portuguese die and just took 100% myself. Yeah, make sure the Portuguese, your Portuguese eye doesn't hear that. I mean, that's pretty understandable, right? Hmm. Yeah, so, just you know, nice oh, right. I gained my victory card. You know, it'd be really funny if Castile gets it and goes bankrupt next month. Where is the victory card? Oh, that's not too bad. It's on Brandenburg. Oh, oh no. No, <laughs> no my real seed. That we're means not playing, I'm we're nearly... not playing for score, I don't think. Uh, well, we're not playing for score. I'll double check on the announcement. I'm nearly a great power actually. <laughs> you were like, yeah, just last man standing. I'm like, bro. Yeah, it's a very last man standing build. <laughs> I got my VC pretty early for once. Oh, yeah, last man standing. Yeah, okay. Shit. <laughs> I, I got my VC on Catalonia, it was so okay, great. Okay, well, it's gonna go bankrupt next month, but at the same time, if they get spawn colonialism, this is gonna be incredibly funny. That would be amazing. <laughs> Come on. But what spawns first, colonialism or bankruptcy? I think Good they question. spawn at the same time. So if you don't Wait, can you not spawn you it if bankrupt. you're bankrupt? You can, there's no conditions. So, so, yeah, okay. <laughs> so that means he could maybe bankrupt... Oh. Someone's yes. got it. Oh, Not got me. It. Austria! Okay, it's, it's an ultimate Austria. theme. Boring. I'm having to watch just like a few seconds after because of the stream delay. Yeah, there actually isn't. It's just lag up for it, but there we go. Uh, well, there we go. So you all are wrong. You all owe me. So who made bets? You all owe me prestige. Everybody got it wrong. Uh, I don't have <laughs> a I country. Didn't bet, so. Okay. Austria, can you help me with this fucking AI? <laughs> you can't take okay. prestige away from a country that doesn't exist. I can like, now! <laughs> it still hasn't gone bankrupt, so it's pretty popular. Oh, uh, guys. I did. How Just is go uh, bankrupt. Why would you tell people that? I can see we can, it. Anyway. We can read. <laughs> oh.
If you yeah, just set up your message right, you can actually see every pang. Uh, wait, so what do you piece out, um... What do you piece out Portugal for? Uh... He hasn't. He's losing. They only have minus 41 wall score though, so you can't even enforce a win. Yeah? Yeah. What do you I mean he's losing? Molding. Wait, how's he Why losing? Sneakers. <laughs> <laughs> Fraud. <laughs> it's... <laughs> France Bruh. carried them. No, France couldn't join the war. No, it was. It was, it war, so there it was, was no peace break. So... Yeah. What? So can still uh, down Portugal because they're expecting Portugal yeah. to join anyway. Yeah, just so backed on Portugal. <laughs> yeah, I, I did a smart move on Portugal. What do you mean? I. Uh, Portugal actually didn't want to join. I am very uh, molding at that. Uh, I don't think that would have probably been the play of Portugal because it was a very dodgy war. Oh, how did he? Also. How did he lose? What happened? So France! Oh, France. France happened! Yep. No, I wiped. I, I had a truce with France. Oh, the poor France, thing France. is confused. Yeah, but that's the thing. Your truce is France, right? But you dowed Portugal. So they got dowed. Why are you pushing them out? Well, because he was like, now nah, I'm going to wait for their bankruptcy. Which is what you wanted to do, to be fair. Yeah, to be fair, that's what you told them to do. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that's what you told them to do. No. I did not, I don't know. You wanted to, though. Wait, was, so what, that was what happened? Strategy. So Portugal called in France? Yep. Yes. Yeah. yeah. And there was After... no truce break. Because it was a defensive war. So it wasn't a truce break. Get right. And <laughs> I'm going to be right. molding over this. <laughs> oh, I left. Mm, well, I had 25 minutes to the end of session. I basically got to the 1500s. Woo! Was speed was just, two like, for like two weeks. I was, I was, bruh. I'd like Don't worry, Castile. You got Isabella. You got Isabella. Yeah, I got her. Oh it. my god! Like, what am uh, I? What, I, what I am I gonna do? Not my fault. I left with a hundred percent on Portugal and nice. you truced out with France. Yeah, that, th fault. that's the problem. You pieced out France, which made him be able to but join the just... Portuguese war. Yeah, that's kind of what happened. You were the problem. No, uh, mm -hmm. it's mostly um, it's mostly Lemon's fault. No, <laughs> no, no, he counted. No, no, no. When he counted, he counted, he counted a rooms. province. He counted a province that was way out in the middle of nowhere as part of mainland Portugal. Okay, that's what I agree. Yeah, by definition of the game, it's not an overseas province because it's in Europe. It is. It, no, no it's but it's not. in the region. You see the region? It's literally in the region. Click super of region. An African. You click the super it's region. The region it's... of North and Africa. And the continent of Europe. So it's not an overseas but province. Regions are all that matter. And it's in the trade Well, they don't, because the way that we define yeah. this, we define, yes, but also Siberia is not part of Europe, and neither is most of the, uh, you know, mainland Ottomans. But again, yeah. I treat, I didn't want to get this it debate is. of what is Europe and what isn't Europe, which is why I use what the game defined as Europe, right? Bro, but it was, it was an the overseas province. The game defines province. Tenerife in, no, no, as An Europe. overseas province is a oh, province that is cares. not connected <laughs> to your capital. And nobody it was not cares. connected. It's in Scotland, an overseas <laughs> province. It is. It's over the no, sea. No, it is not. It's over the Baltic Sea, is it not? The Baltic? You... What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> what? Mm, Wait. Wait. Are you a moron? So the the Baltic famous sea. Baltic Sea. That one's, uh, that one's the Atlantic? Because <laughs> it's not over a sea, it's in the same sea. Okay, it so Lemon, I see one one possible fix to this. You uh, let me annex Portugal and France completely. <laughs> <laughs> How about you just think you mean integrate your tags? <laughs> right, yes, I see. Um, you know what? I think the oh, fair fix to this is that you know the Tenerife modifier. I'm just gonna put that on every single province in Castile that remains. That they yeah. Can we can we just have that everywhere, please? Yes, that I agree. You <laughs> that just on every province. Yeah. On every province. Yeah. The rest is gonna stack with itself because I tested this. Yeah. If you have yeah, ten you Tenerifes, all ten Tenerifes give you twenty percent of your steam. So every time you take a yeah. So oh, Kazan right. would have like a slightly more England, than like... England custom nation battle royale where every single province in England, every single Yoda province in England, it gives you a 10% force to So, quick question. Hmm. What so, would happen if you made I, every I, province so, a thousand devs? What's... Wait a minute, Just I did still, a video on that. Why did, <laughs> why did he mark up at least after... He's he bankrupt. Well... But why he didn't have Nassim... to go bankrupt. He did, he, he got had... Um, he, he was, I had all I had, the like, loans. I had a thousand five hundred ducats. Yeah. Well, by the time you got over, he has 900 ducats, and you're losing 60 ducats a month without mercs. 
Yeah, you had like below a thousand yeah, that, when that I. That was not winnable, I'm afraid. Points. The only way you would have won that is white piece Portugal, or you know, enforced the piece on Portugal. But then you would have died five years later when France died. I'm quite convinced that um, Savoy's dying to Milan. Bro, I could. Uh, yeah, I am. I am. Fucking beat him. That's what you deserve for joining that war. No, it actually, is as well. What the hell? Yeah. Yeah. Bro, just like, honest, take loans. I did. I took loans. I've murked up. But, like, oh my god, he's over, he's over first in his death for him, the left. Oh my god. Oh, uh, yeah, guy, I, I, um, I'm con to Florence. That, okay. <laughs> That's still cool. <laughs> yeah, just return all your cores. I think you should be able to, if, even if we occupy. I don't think there's. Nope, you can't. This game can go on for two cores. Two cores, still. Two cores. Well, I mean, that's if France can take that much from Castile. Personally, I don't think because this. Because France uh, occupied all the Aragon Aragon is battle. Oh, wait. It's... Also, oh, uh, Portugal already went. By back. the way, um, Savoy, do you think you could just, like. You think you could do me a solid and just put. put just see, oh, start yeah, sieging also, down both Milan's provinces so that they would. Yeah, yeah I'm 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 piece of Well, I've got to kill these for a piece of It's 100% well, an Uncon, it's literally the same. It's a full yeah. rendition. Rip Castile. Uh, uh, nothing oh, of that was my fault. That <laughs> is actually the Portuguese beautiful. borders have been restored, and you know what, France? That... Thank you. Thank you for I blame. This I blame the, the Platinum guy. Be, um... I blame him. I blame you for piecing out France. Oh, I, 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 I was actually was going to piece out. Port, think about piece out. Port Why port blame me? Just be happy I that I actually myself. took the country instead of letting AI do this. Yeah. Yeah. I was. I was. Well, they would have peace out Portugal, right? They, yeah, I tried no. to peace out Portugal, but when France intervened, uh, the war scores aren't enough to peace out the Portuguese. Yeah. Oh, I, I, oh, I see. Portugal's I'm... got the Grand Canaries. Oh, yes. Can we you didn't um, even release the arms? Savoy, do you think you could just quickly start CG down Milan so they won't join a war? So, guys. I mean, I can annex this guy. Uh, I don't think Leon. the game is going to go on too much longer. Look, I I'm uh, sure am not in a position to be doing much of anything beneficial to anyone right now. I kind of <laughs> suck at this game, despite having <laughs> over 3,000 hours in it, so... Well, multiplayer is totally different, players. Yeah, I yeah. have... Uh, Doesn't uh, matter how much you have seen. I'm actually new. I'm right? two hours off 1.200. Sorry, 1.2,000. <laughs> Hmm, should I get a few on you? Christ, I... you've done this in 120 hours, that's impressive. <laughs> I, I it's so weird. Two, that... I have like 4k in single player and almost 2k in multiplayer. Yeah. That's nothing, I've seen like city people go like, I'm meant to be really good at this random shooter game, I've got almost 100 hours in this. I'm like, Christ, 100 hours. Like, <laughs> terrible. You, what, you have no idea what you're doing, you're basically like, uh, what is the load? <laughs> Yeah, I, I've got um. Loans are scary. You're not supposed to take them. That, that's the level they are on. Look, After 100 so... hours. Oh god, I remember oh, what I was like. It instantly invites the killer, and then no. It's, not having a card it's funny because that's exactly what the AI does. <laughs> as soon as they get alone, they just don't want to join anymore. <laughs> yeah. In all my first, my first game of EU4 was I'm gonna play Brandenburg, and then I clicked. It was back when the old missions. It's like you know you have to select one of the like task things. It's like a random. Oh god, mission. that's so. And I clicked old. that, and they told me, "Oh hi, um, I, your mission is to take Silesia." It's like okay. Then I no CB Silesia. <laughs> yeah. I remember playing Boy 4 and not knowing how the peace deal works or in the tutorial. Like, you, yeah, I could take Ethiopia, and then I click done. And then every time it just left Ethiopia independent, I was like, bruh, why the fuck can't I take it if I click done and annex it? And then you had to pass a turn, which makes zero sense to me to this day. Hey, you know, I, my... I, I just don't look at that game anymore. I... My first. So... EU4 game, I, I lost to the Mavlix's Ottomans because I didn't know how to build units. <laughs> my yeah. very first game, I, f I oh, played as France, and I got yes. a game over like within the first 20 years. Uh, and... How? As, as which country, I think, is the most important. <laughs> as as France. As oh, France. Wow. <laughs> no. I mate. don't. I don't well, my, my first country. Impressive, so, I'm not gonna lie. Didn't even speed run game over as the night. Well, my, my <laughs> first country was Holland. I formed. I, I didn't form. So the Belgium guys, like Flanders and all that, formed the Netherlands before I could form it.
And oh, then, I, and then they stole the Dutch Republic because they got it instantly. So I couldn't actually get it as, another, as Holland. Christ. I mean, for a first game, that's still pretty impressive. Yeah, and then I died. My first, my first game was actually pretty okay. Uh, only I didn't know how it worked, and I was playing as Holland as well. So. Yeah, yeah, know, same. I went. Same. <laughs> I like, like, what the time. fuck are all these guys attacking me? Like, what? <laughs> kind of fucking <laughs> I had quite a lot. I've had a lot of fun as Portugal. Yo, Florence, do you want to go to war again? I guess so. Ah, uh, Sweden. I'm so <laughs> let's go. Oh, what the fuck? <laughs> Wait, what did Sweden do? Oh, oh they it's prevented it's me from seeing a player in, 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 <laughs> on England. That's what I did. <laughs> oh, you done? Right. Well, let's let them be before they reveal their entire military plans on the uh, on stream. But there we go. There we go. All right. Well, I lost 15 minutes, so that would be all for uh, peace deals for everyone soon to you. Uh, that's another year or two. I think that's going to be another two years, but there we go. Also, that's the rest in peace for Georgia. Oh, they, oh no, are they brain dead? I think the AI Georgia's brain dead. Oh, rest in peace. Actually, right. Very important question. Would we be happy to do this again with, like, proper seeding? And I do more uh, yeah. I don't know. Yeah, but, like, I don't think island in the much middle of nowhere not moment. count as... It's yeah, a very... Yeah, I think... Yeah, Let's I think be it's out. yeah, I like this a lot better because, like, you actually fight people in the beginning. Lemon, let me peace out for I mean, ten really. Nice, but the game okay. too fast. So I think some I people think drop out. But... Lemon, Lemon, this is what we should do. Asia, it's it's a bigger continent, so no. there's, there's more less like. Oh, it's not. Play. Is there? Yeah. Asia, yeah, yeah, it's a lot less viable tax, and also what I'm going to do. Europa has more depth than it. Thingy and play uh, uh, small nations in that area, yeah. But then what? Main in Asia, a couple Japanese daimyos, and that's it. You know, India tends to unite to one player, whatever map you give it. Yeah, so do that anyway. You can't really, you, just, you know, unite Europe. You could just expand Europe a little bit to make it a little bigger. Oh, wait, you, sh you can put North Africa. Why don't we just do a normal game? Yeah, I, I agree. Like but with, I don't know. But with yeah. your yeah, let me, let me. We do a mod. We do a... Uh, oh, yeah. We do yeah. A multi Next time, mod. can we have multi a map, please? Like this yeah. one? Yeah. 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 Uh, Lemon, we can go with my I, amazing I idea. That... I will I will accept a mod for one condition and one condition only. There will be a subscribe to Lemon Kid, but... Obviously. <laughs> Obviously. What Obviously. else would we have? Henry, <laughs> let Lemon... Tag, right? We need to go right. with my amazing idea that everyone gets to put the random oh, country on the wheel. No, <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. Then, no. no. Because then Never you get again. to meme it by saying, I want to play arm. Oh, oh, sorry, I can't make the session dips. You know? Yeah, no, yeah. that is. I, I, mean, cannot, like... I cannot think of a worse idea. <laughs> <laughs> no, I can think of a worse amazing. idea. GC 50 player co op arm. Oh, uh, yeah. No, that's hey, uh, that's glitch, a better glitch. idea. Just so you know, I was winning when I left. So team came. Yeah, but then you pieced out France. Two player team came. I was winning yeah, when yeah, I left. I'm well showing it. I could, I could like try and draw up an equal, like, you know, I could make, like, I could make, I guess, like a, you know, uh, I don't know. Uh, France, Mega Provence, oh. Castile, Portugal, like, they're both locked teams, and Lemon, England, can, Scotland, can locked teams, Germany, uh, Lemon, Germany, Bavaria, good... locked team. Country Lemon, weren't you Aragon? I was put on Novagrad! 
What on earth is yeah, Novigrad? Give me a good country. I will make the country good, okay? We, good I will have to, make... because we'll be seeding. But yeah, I guess... Sure. You make yeah. it still we'll good? <laughs> Bro, think, right. yo, I, I, I'm a good player, yes. If you do you end up subbing, by the way, Make sure you let me know that you're subbing. Why am I always four people? <laughs> Motherfucking <laughs> siege of Milan! Goddamn motherfucking food shortage for the third fucking <laughs> time in a row! <laughs> you good there, mate. You good. <laughs> Christ, that was passionate. It uh, was. I'm now uh, with four people because um, Main's annexed Nassau. And now they've fucking released Nassau. So, George is dying at Carmen. Nice. Yeah. Ah, so I I don't worry, worry the defenders are the the last hurt. dance again. Mm. Mm. It's only a forty-two percent chance you win it. So my no economy is draining. I'm going to go bankrupt after. Why the this hell war. do I'm you? Going... Why are you actually <laughs> bankruptcy warring the goddamn AI? What the? F because <laughs> I tried killing them and the Milanese beat me in like three battles <laughs> in a row. The after base Milan have like, taken defensive ideas. The base Milan have taken defensive ideas. And it's fucking working. So, uh, they're Lemon, they're who... fucking defending. Lemon, who am I playing next session? Come on, Milan. Uh, come on. Whoever's food shortage like in fucking it's Milan. Let's it's go. Not... It's not... Not... It's not... It's not... You start so many of them. They're now at half four, so you actually have made siege progress. Is any constellation? It still it's is a very now. viable nation. You should go back on it. It is so dead. <laughs> you and uh, it's Mr. Oh, are you telling me your country's getting overrun by some zealots over there? Yeah. Defenders Yo, yeah. desert. Lemon. Well, oh yeah. yeah. Stronger than Lemon. Portugal. Next session, mm -hmm. if you fix England, I will play them. No, I'm not. They're literally London is occupied by France. I'm oh. not. Going well, that's to not fair to fix England because by the end of the if session. If you fix Bavaria and give me some provinces, I'll play. I'm gonna probably fix Brandenburg. That's a definite. And I, I might. Just, how... You know what? Screw it. I'm gonna. I'm gonna. I'm gonna Lorraine integrate Brandenburg and, well. and then just have that. Fix Poland as well, because like we just have a Kazan that's just gonna eat a bunch of AI. Yeah, that's fair. I'm gonna. I'm gonna. Yes, I'll make a Kiev. Finally. Oh my god. Exactly, that's the base method. Now, better one with days. Kiev is that with Kiev, every new tag that exists will press a button. Lemon, Lemon, make the Cossack Republic. The Cossack Republic, make that one. Uh, Zaporozhye. Yeah, 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 do that is one. Is that how you spell it? That's how you pronounce it. It's for the Macreed. Oh, my last fallen, there you go. You happy now? 793 <laughs> days. He's still salty. I've had longer sieges. I've had a, I had a 900 day one. That was not fun. In single player, but still. Yeah. Um. I had that multiplayer. But I think I haven't, I haven't. The only siege I've seen nine, longer than 100 is when it's like you know Corfu gets separatists and then your Ottomans and you overtake them. Like. Uh, yeah. Yeah. That's the only well, I was annexing my 60. 60. There was some like 200 years. <laughs> I, I mean sieging, run. not annexing. <laughs> yeah. But still 200 right. years. Guys, let, let's see what nations can get fixed. Uh, Bavaria <laughs> is fine. Alright, do you think Florence needs to stay fixed? Yeah. I have a lot uh, of can rebels. I... They're bragging okay. me. Okay, I'll get rid of the rebels. Sweet. <laughs> yeah, Portugal needs yeah. one as well. The Tenerife modifier is too weak. No. No. I'm, I'm not ranking though. I think if I if I do the Tenerife to allow more of a extra in world, I think I'll modify Tenerife to also um have uh, to also have a 25 naval force limit, a plus 10 naval force limit. Yeah, could you fix my economy? <laughs> no. <laughs> That's impossible. Can you fix too weak for that. Lemon, can you fix Castile? No. Even God, uh... even God can't fix them now. <laughs> <They're beyond. laughs> Just give me Tenerife if that's yeah, all I want. Uh... I'll give Castile their own Tenerife. Uh, yeah, just make a run an island at the middle of the Atlantic. I can't actually have a command, so I need to update the mod to do that, and I'm just not going to do that. So there you go. Yes, rip. I just want... I'm going to be Dutch Brazil again. Dutch Brazil! <laughs> oh Christ, well, the tutor's got reclaim the my... I need to reclaim my title. Right, well... Sessions ending soon, TM. January, February, March. Yeah, probably will be this year. Depends how well speed three goes. Yeah, I might have to end it a bit earlier. I might just say we'll end a bit early.
No. I want Wait, don't do it. Don't do it. Yeah, don't do it. Yeah, don't do it. Yeah. Okay. Are you, if are you, is everyone happy? To I run want like five minutes over then. Yeah. 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 Okay. yeah. Hi, uh, is everyone happy to run five minutes over? Because then we end in a yes. year and a half. Oh, yes, uh, yes, yes, yes. Uh, everyone That's besides Kara, man. Okay. I mean, I want to end this right now, but... I mean, yeah, George, well, is, George is brain dead. Stop. Yeah, I know. That's why it's like, I can't fix that, but not in last second, so it'll be fine. Right, okay, congratulations. Um, channel. <laughs> you're, getting a year, you're getting a year and a half, but there you go. Nice. I want Nathan to fix a tag into Lithuania. Maybe feed Minx like a bunch Please of calls. Don't, don't fix Nathan, that's dead. No, no, Minx. I'll uh, make a reseedable tag there. I mean, to be fair, they did die when they were like, AI, so. Yeah. Just so it that, is like. Somewhat fair enough. There's, I kind of want to reach the point where I can look at the map and every player, and every single promise is player. <laughs> so I don't think that's going to happen. As the long as I get the playable tag, I'm happy. <laughs> okay, Brandenburg or Platinator Bavaria it is. I'll take Brandenburg, thanks. Yeah, I'll see. I might have to put the original Brandenburg player back on Brandenburg. By the way, um, you can get innovativeness from a tech that's plus 5%. Two techs that are plus five percent. Uh, yeah, the only tech I can take is mill tech. I'm I sorry. can take both. Of them. I don't. I don't get this. I do. Uh, I haven't teched up once in dip this entire time. Probably should. Who's behind <laughs> at the start? Oh yeah, have you? Sir, have you seen? I was one of my earlier games. I've been on doing. Here. I've been doing some Devin. There was a uh, yeah. There was a there was a player here ages ago, right? It was just like his like first couple games. He had this genius new strategy, right? So he explained the map box, and he had this plan where. Like, admin tech is important, you get ideas, no tech is important, right? But what's the point of dead tech, right? It's I right. totally agree. Right, so you know what he did? He stick, he was, by the end, 11 admin, 3 dip, 11 mil. He never took a single dip tech. And spent I mean, all that it, it's, a somewhat, it's a somewhat valid strategy. Like He got 11 now. corruption from Ambassador but, but you, you do have to You do have to do it a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> just yeah, keep it took three a behind and take it super cheap every time. Well, you yeah, never took the tag. Mine costs... Oh, I don't know how much. I need to. Sorry, I need to focus. Can we go down to speed two for a second? <laughs> no. I need to. If we go down to speed two, and spend set, I need to do the time. thing, and I think there's only like. Oh, there's not long. Not I, I didn't. Oh, I didn't get the innovativeness. <laughs> okay, never mind. Why would you? Oh, are you trying to get on fifteen percent? <laughs> No, 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 no. So it was the 1st of January was when they took it. And the 1st of January was also when it went to minus 5%. Uh, so, so I had they... to wait until the 1st of January. So then you can take it at plus 15 with the notifications. Uh, yes. my, yeah, my sister, Christ. But I missed it because we were at speed 3. Also, they wouldn't have gone to minus 15. Oh, it would have, of course, yeah. No, no, not with the dip. It wasn't dip tech, it was admin. Yeah, still, oh well. I got more rebels, nice. Okay, well, it's like I can't next. They're, ki they're, they're killing bubbles, dead drops. <laughs> <laughs> Based Orthodox Melan Milan is dead. Long live Milan. Ah, but is it prospering times in Naples while it's getting sieged out? Then? It's Venice and Switzerland gonna deck on you. That's the question. Okay, Austria still. Probably right. fucking Lee Lamo. <laughs> the coalition CB is going to turn around on you. <laughs> oh, there we go. Right. Well, we're approaching an end here sooner rather than later. Kazan, how have you still not colonized the Siberian, beautiful Siberian world? Because he's not gone for the thing, which I think is the right choice. He hasn't gone. I would, I would take it, colonize the five and drop it. I mean, he, he was doing that, but he had a zero admin ruler for like when he was doing that, which is, yeah, in my opinion, kind of stupid. As well. so... Yeah, he kind of well, does need the admin He soon points. has admin take 7, so he might choose to do it at that point, who knows? Yeah, well, he's been really behind. Has he finished, he has uh... Has he finished? No. He's not even... <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> has anyone else finished? Um... At least he can go, uh, yes. uh, Russia soon. If he either gets milk, admin take 10. <laughs> Oh, he can go rushed. Did he, um... Well, he's, he's been not a nomad, so he needs to reform his government. There are three people who finished 
two idea groups. Excellent. So me, you, and Florence, I guess. Yeah. Well, I finished so mine 15 orange. years ago. <laughs> I well. finished mine during war. Yeah. Uh, I finished mine during war as well. I think. I, I think that's probably that's pretty decent. 1490 for finishing economics. Especially in this, because you have to fight a lot more players by definition. It's impressive. Oh, I, I don't think this country's fought a single player. Oh, it has, hasn't it, actually? Has it? Uh, Austria, at the start. Oh, yeah, you dishonored that. Oh, yeah, like two months, and then With they. Did. Yeah, you dishonored that. You didn't actually fight him. <laughs> Did they? Oh. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, I, I don't remember him saying he. Uh... Well, it's in quite uh, nice. Well, we are uh, approaching the end. Can quite so, easily support like 50k. I guess death oh, no. comes for us all. I, I think my country is going to fall okay, apart. Okay, we're not going to be uh, we're not going to be ending late, my, thankfully. My Yay. country is looking so bad in Skanderbeck now. <laughs> yeah, based. <laughs> my mine's pretty shit still. I kind of would have won oh, money. God. Look at my unrest. Yay! I can actually make it. <laughs> Oh, it was so close. <laughs> oh. I mean, well, it's not. Is it still going to be shit because it hadn't been a month? No, I didn't. It has been thirty. Yep, and there we go. Nice. The month tick. Yep. I did in last time. Yep. I Very impressive. Yeah, it's the month tick because I paused and realized it was on the first. He accepted, and I paused. And <laughs> That's, that is very lucky. Oh. I surely want to look look weak in Scandalbag though. You'd rather yeah. make it stronger. No. It's, it's all about comparing dick sizes, Lemon. Come on. Okay. Yeah, it's all about killing Civil War. Next week. Right, well, Please, your no. save is complete. So Look, I'm go. dead. I'm dead well, anyway. That's... Like, I'm gonna have tons of to rebels. I'm gonna fall apart because I just... Too bad you took Milano. I... Right, well, that was all fun and games. Hope you enjoyed the uh, last of me sitting in that voice chat. Ooh, that was fun. Anyway, but that does conclude the end of that stream. So, as always, thank you very much for watching. And